wave a thirsty head. A perfumed thank you they seemed to say. Surely here was charm beyond compare to you. Maybe it was just that I was there with you. It was just a garden in the rain. But then the sun came out again and sent us happily on our way. Hello. Good morning, good evening, good afternoon, whatever it is for you. I hope you're having an absolutely delightful day. How are we doing? And how are you? <laughs> I hope you're doing well. I very much do. It is morning for me. I see my little clock down there. It is ten past eight in the morning. That music a bit loud, isn't it? Let me... There we go. Good morning, good afternoon, good evening, good whatever it is. <laughs> welcome in Joker, welcome in One Hit Pony, welcome in SCP-1762-B-O-L. Rory, Space Fish, the wonderful Space Fish, how are you? And welcome! <sighs> it is a Saturday morning. It is a delightful day. And today I'm going to be another little lady. As per chat demanded, after finishing uh, the other game, that I started Fran Rao, and I promise you I'd do it. And here we are. I'm just a little lady. I'm very excited. I'm very excited. Little Miss Fortune was such a pleasure. Being able to play another game apparently like that. Apparently it was that I'd very much enjoy Fran Bauer as I enjoyed um, Little Miss Fortune, so... <laughs> Most delightful, it's 2am! 2am! Go to sleep! Good Watching Ada get drilled was very good. To be fair, it was. It was a very good animation. I did. I slept rather well, actually. Once I once I got to sleep, it was one of those instances where I just could not get to sleep. But the second I did, this oh, is concerning. Oh my! You, you should be concerned. concerned. You should be concerned. You should always be concerned. <laughs> and hello, Spread. How are you? And hello, Nephilim. Pleasure to see you as always. Bit of a dry throat and getting tired. Well, Rory, go and get some rest when you can, of course. And one hit. I'm glad to hear you're doing well, of course. At the Phoenix, hello, hello, hello. It's good to see you, cutie. Well, well, I know the chat's full of cuties, isn't it? Good to see all of the cuties here. I would go to sleep, except I got a disturbing phone call and my car alarm went off. Well, you're an SCP. What do you expect? These things are going to happen. You basically exude, like, strained phenomena. Phenomena. Phenomenae? Phenomena? Phenomena. 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 Do, 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 do. <laughs> ba, 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 Oh, and there's the pug. Oh, I love that pug. I love that pug. I love it. I love it. I love it. I love it. And welcome in, Raiders. Welcome in. Welcome in. And a welcome in, external soul. How 
are you doing, my lovely jubbly? How are you? How are you? Ada get drilled was very good. Don't make me take that away. I will take away your drilling privileges. <laughs> How are you? How is your stream? What are you up to? Pray tell. Give me all of the juicy details. You know I love them so. Mwah. I was just saying hello to everyone. We've only just started. So perfect timing, really. One point and no cooldown. I know. Did we break you last stream? Probably. Probably. That's why I farted around with my blurbs. So you can just have it for this. You, you can have the mayhem. I, I, I will give you the mayhem. Now I'm powered up. That's okay, I see. I did. I did. The back door is open. The bus cats have been coming in and out. Meow. Everyone says, with the matter of fact, as I work evenings, I normally only use. This is concerning. Oh my. Wishing you should get drilled. Okay, well, you. Oh, okay. Have your chaos. Get it out. Just go on. Get it out. This is concerning. Oh my. You should be wishing you to get drilled. This is concerning. Oh my. You should be wishing you to get drilled. was very good. It was very good. We're playing some Fortnite. We got the revive clutch. Oh, nice. This is concerning. Oh, my. This is concerning. Oh, my. You should be concerned. This is concerning. Oh, my. This is concerning. Oh, my. You should be concerned. You good? Put it out your system? Don't you squirrel me. Watching Ada get drilled was Right, that's it. That's it. You got rid of your privileges. Where is it? Channel points. Channel points. Your posture is regrettable. Concentrate on sitting straight. <laughs> Thank you for the posture check. I'll put them on 200, though. It won't make it too expensive. That way you can still kind of semi spam. Hello, Gavna. Hello, Gavna. Oh wait, Python, you're not new here, mate, but welcome in regardless. <laughs> How are you doing? You truly are my favourite of my- Oh, stop it. Now you're just making me blush. But I'm glad to hear you got the clutch revive. Oh, I was playing some Fortnite last night. And we had exactly the same situation. Except obviously I wasn't the one revived, because there's no way you'd win if you clutch revived me. <laughs> Vals from hello! Meow! Are oh, you welcome? Oh, that's an that is such an Is that nurse's. Is that one of her remotes? Oh, that's so cute. What do I get the head pass for? <laughs> Thank you. Thank you. Hello, Wolfie Love! Welcome, welcome! We'll get you all the wins. The council should protect President Mark. I got, I got, I did get a new skin though last night. I got the Plague Doctor one, which I'm very happy about. I like patting heads and hugs and I can't hug. That's okay. Correct me with head pads. I'm more than happy to. There's one of the things that, let's, let's stop. Right. By the by, what kind of moth? I am an elephant hawk moth. Oh no, Delphina er Oh, I can never say it. I can never say my own kind's name. It's awful, isn't it? Delphina Elfino. El Elpno? Elpno? Delphila Elpro. Either way, elephant hawk moth. <laughs> Who needs Latin? You need to hydrate to go with my foodie woody. Oh, thank you for the foodie woody. Very much appreciated. The morbid moth, guess what? What? Oh my lord. Oh, what is happening? Oh my! Such to your cute. <laughs> what is that demonic 
friends. Well, thanks for that. We now have a demon on the stream. Of course, streamer. You take care of yourself. No worries at all. Teacher, I got a note to prove my tiredness is acceptable. Do you though? Where's your note? Where's your note? Oh no, I've broken. You broke time. In it, bro. No, that's okay. It's uh, only Kristan. Hello, welcome. Thank you for the hydrate. What's your note to say that your tardiness is acceptable? Hmm. Oh, tardy. I hate that word, tardy. Why do you say tardy? Not why don't you just say late? I'm late. Why not tardy? I'm tardy. It just sounds. Bleh. Bleh. It just sounds icky. I don't like it. It's not a word I like. Tardy. Oh, you magician, the strangest thing, but every time I look at you, everyone has to... You can't arrest me at 20 past 8 in the morning. You can't do this. Verboded. Oh my god, those hamsters. <laughs> moths are the better version of butterflies. Absolutely, thank you. Butterflies are just want to be moths, you know what I mean? They're just like, you're good to be, I'm so pretty. And it's like, no, moths. Moths OG. Goth butterflies. Precisely! I'm doing very well, thank you, Kristen. How are you doing? You were just in time because bum, 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 bum. we are going to play some Fran Bao today. I hope you're as excited as I am. I promise chat and chat shall receive. If I had a nickel for every time I saw someone's beautiful, I'd still live. Oh, stop it. 20 past eight. No. Come back to me when it's like, I don't know, it was, it was a good riz time. After 12 o'clock, after midday, after midday you could riz. Before then, <laughs> it's too early. A number of moths are more colourful than butterflies. They are, actually. There is also one type of moth that eats other moths. It's rather terrifying. I think butterflies drink blood. Fun fact. A moth wouldn't do that to you. Well, they might do. Shh, shh. Back is hurting, but nothing too bad. Mm -hmm. I hope you feel better soon. I didn't miss you, so I'm happy to catch you. Oh. Well, like I said, that for those who missed the community day yesterday, fret not. There will be another one, and it will be at the later time zone. So, obviously, I did one which was, for me, morning. Um, I will do one for me, evening, which will be, hopefully, your awake time. At some point in the near future. Don't worry, I'll do one for every, like each time zone section, hopefully. Just need to find an evening where I can do that. Wolfie's tardiness is because of the application update. Mm, I'll allow it, but only because cute papa. Only because of cute papa. That's the only reason. <laughs> of course. Ladybugs are fantastic. Dragonflies. Oh, dragonflies are so underrated. Flirt after coffee. Mm -hmm. Flirt after any kind of caffeine first. it would be a bunch of free stuff today, so it's fine. Fantastic. Get you then. Looks like a little candy. Oh. <laughs> well, I am delectably sweet, I hope. Right. Uh, oh, hi, Tech. How are you? You. Oh no, you don't. What did I say? No riz until after 12. No more, no more. You're such a mostly wholesome sweetheart from the stream. She endlessly provides you an insurmountable blessing for the adorably wholesome person you are. You always make sure all of our spirits are out of dark places of in life itself from the endless content you sit. Oh, I wouldn't say my content is endless. <laughs> but thank you so much, Tech. Much love, much love to you. You should go by now. No, stop it. I will forbid you, like I said, I will forbid you for, for sending me love. I will. <laughs> it's not allowed. You're too sweet. You're far too sweet. Far oh, sweet. I was made fun of the younger for liking moths. Ooh, what do you mean? I never get people who are scared of moths. They're harmless. Come on. You're telling me. You're telling me you wouldn't let this cutie in. Like, come on. Look at them. You just want to 
got your lamps. Don't you got any lamps? Like, how is that going to hurt you? Come on. Look at the glowing red eyes. Look at the fluff. Look at the perfection. Look at that. That is peak form right there. Oh, don't put me in jail. What? <laughs> I've done absolutely nothing wrong here. Nothing. Nada. Look, this guy can prove it too. See? I mean, come on. Look at them. Look at the little fluffy legs. Look at that. How do you hate such a thing? I'm going to have to numb them off and test how sweet. Stop it. I'm watching you. No numbing. Because I'll only munch you first. Nom, 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 nom. Ah, nom, 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 nom. Some Link's Awakening. Ooh, very nice. See you later. Of course, Python. You take care. Have a wonderful day or evening. You silly but confident? Bro, that is my entire ethos. I have no idea what I'm doing. I'm completely incompetent, but I have a smile on my face, and that's the plan. <laughs> All the lights are in the roof, and they would fall on you. They wouldn't fall on you. More than Ladder House because of this fight. Please tell me you mean because it would attract spiders rather than actually having preferred pet spiders. Please tell me that's what you mean. Regardless of me questioning your judgments, we have a motivation from Bob's. And we've not had a motivation today yet, this morning. So, without further ado, Mobs. Thank you for the motivation. The motivation for you and us is... Let's try staying. <laughs> Please try staying. Thank you. Oh. <laughs> Why? <laughs> Please try staying. That is adorable. Although slightly terrifying. <laughs> the bot is lonely. Oh, it's okay, bot. Have you? <laughs> oh, bot. <Aww. laughs> now I just feel bad for bullying, like, a bot now. My life is all about ABCs. Apple bottom jeans, boots with the fur. Cri crippling depression. Crippling depression. Uh, Alexa, play Despacito. <laughs> Especially, of course, you can leave. It's the bot who wanted the attention. If you're a triangle, you'd be cute. Right, and on that note, let's go to the game, shall we? <laughs> get to the game, shall we? Not get rid of me that easily. Are you sure about that? Are you sure? Just prepare for trouble. And make it double! <laughs> I'm sorry, I had to. I had to. I had to. I'm just trying to sort out little move here. I'm fed up of not having Moof on the screen. He's an adorable little being and he does the text to speech. There we go, he can go there. Okay, he can go there. And then when we go over here, hello, it's me again. If I crop me out of the picture. Oops, still going. Don't want me here. No, no, no milfs allowed. Oops, still going. There we go. And then we can move him up, and he can be like a little chat guardian. Guardian of the chat. There we go. <laughs> oh, 
He did have a cushion, actually. Let me get his cushion out. Where's his cushion? Hang on. Whilst I'm here... See, again, normally you would do these things off stream, but where's the fun in that when you guys can see the process of me having a substantial breakdown over trying to find a cushion? Oh dear. Someone's got the coffles. Where is it? Oh, bless you. Where's the cushions? Where are the cushions? I demand the cushions! Ah, here we go. Emotional damage! Don't emotional damage me. What colour cushion do, does he want? What colour cushion does Muth want? What does this little creature want? You tell me, you tell me. Just popping in to say hi before I head off. Of course, Mad Dog! Thank you so much! How are you? Popping by, don't mind me, I'm just editing this here. Good to make sure he's well kept for, you know? But look after each other here. No matter what little form you might take. Oh, no, too far. This is concerning. Oh my. If you were a burger at McDonald's, you would be the McGorgeous. <laughs> the McGorge. McGorge. Mm mm tips for Dora. McGorgeous. <laughs> I don't know where to put him. Where do we put him? Ooh, ooh, now I'm shuffling myself along. What's going on here? Why am I moving? I shouldn't be moving. This has nothing to do with me. This is all to do with move. Again, what colour cushion? Do we want a green one? Lilac, a pink one. A nice regal red. I'm thinking a nice green. Oh, look at that. That is fantastic. Eh. Eh. There we go. You're gonna shove him in the corner over here. Watching, Watching Ada, Ada get, get drilled, drilled was, was very good. good. Oh my goodness. What is it with you and Ada being drilled? Oh great, now look what I've done. Now look what you've done. Look what you've done to the- Now we're stuck behind a border. Moth be like fiddle de do fiddle de day, <laughs> don't mind me, I'm just buying games on Steam that I'll probably never play. A bit rude, have you though? I already have the game installed and downloaded. I'm just making sure my little fella is comfortable, see? Thank you. <laughs> Absolute cheek of you, how dare you? <laughs> Once I find out who did that, I will find you. And I will commend you, because that that was quite fun. There you go, one cushion there. One small bean. There we go, that's better. How's that? What do you reckon? Do you think he looks comfortable there? Well, tough, because I'm leaving it like that. <laughs> oh, dearie me. Right, let's get the key. You can't do Wes- Wesker is turned off at the moment still. There will be a Wesker. Wesker will make a return, do not worry. But just not at the moment. <laughs> Ash, that was you who said the burger- Oh my goodness! Also, Scoot, hello! <laughs> My goodness oh my goodness oh my goodness welcome in welcome in raiders how are you doing Destra, thank you so much for the raid how are you <gasps> oh my gosh hi let me, let me give you a shout out what what are you up to pray tell pray tell Destra, pray tell i was just about to open the game but how are you my lovely what are you doing Ah, oh, you sound so cute. Oh, bless you. Thank you. <laughs> well, you caught me just trying to set up the game, which, as my as everyone knows who uh, frequently visits me, I play 
about it because I'm dumb. So, Hollow Knight. Oh, wow. We have a real game. <gasps> we have someone who can actually play video games. And <gasps> chat, chat, chat. We have someone who can play video games. Holy cow. How did you do? How was it? How was it? Oh, I wish I could play Hollow Knight. I've attempted it and it is. <laughs> it was a time. That's all I say. It was a time. Hello, Governor. Uh, hello, Governor. Frosty, I see you there. Hello. It was fun. Well, that's the main thing, isn't it? I'm enjoying it a lot. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Good, good. I'm glad to hear that. Internet fair. Don't you dare. <laughs> no, but not be another. Race. I've just had one. No, I'm. No. No, better not be my own fortune. I've literally just had one and I'm yet to start my game. Let me start my game. <laughs> it's not from Twitch, it's from Discord, so no official raid. Okay, good, good, good. What, what, what do you mean, actually? We are raiding on behalf of Miss Fortune. Welcome in, raiders. Welcome in. You just, I've just had a raid. Oh my goodness. Well, let me give you your shout out as well. That still counts. I have to wait 20 seconds. Wow. Absolute disgrace. How are you? What are you doing on Discord? Look at everybody playing cool games and things. Hello, Hello Governor. Oh my gosh, and now whisper it. Hello, Governor. Are you alright, mate? <laughs> Welcome in, Wisp. Welcome in. I was playing a duck. There's adults, Dolores? What would that even be? Watching Ada get drilled. Hello, Gabnat. What? You know what? Don't, don't answer that. I don't know what that is, but sure. You may think I oh, am Lord. gone, but I'm still here. Oh, no. Watching. Don't you dare! How dare you! Don't bring Wesker into this! <laughs> Christian, how dare you? Stellar is that an instant Twitch brand? I mean, I gathered that, I gathered that. So we're playing on Discord because it's it, okay. Did you have fun though? That's what we were just discussing. Did you have fun though? Or Fig Dionysus, unless you're Wesker, I very much doubt that I have you on a pillow. <laughs> oh, so Mothic has a Wesker body pillow, but because... What's your tone with me, young man? Right. Super villain, thank you so much for the raid. I hope you're doing well. Uh, when are we playing Left 4 Dead again? <laughs> Not that I'm like craving it or anything like that. No, no, no. Not that I had such a blast with you all. <laughs> that I needed to play it again, like a step. Stellar is interesting. The advisor voice telling me I finished researching science technology as was just. <laughs> Kind of science advisor. That sounds like they know science, but hey ho, maybe they have a biology. <laughs> we could do it next week. Ooh. I'm sold. Absolutely sold. Right. Chris Chan, I don't know what you're doing, but maybe don't. <laughs> I'm scared. See, I want to go and start the game, but I'm worried about what Christian's doing. James, hello. But why am I in jail? I've done nothing wrong yet. Yet. Unless I have. But I've almost shouted. I'm wonderful. I'm delightful. Oh, yep. No, I will have the jar, though. I will take the jar. 
Uh, don't get me out of the jar. I'm quite safe in here, thank you. You've denied a chatter's wishes. <laughs> Rude. I listen to chat and stream and do nothing. Oh no! <laughs> now I'm scared. Chat, you have more power over me than you realise, you know. Okay, I don't know what's going on, but I'm, I'm going to go to the game. The game can protect me. How does it feel to be in a jar? Pretty comfortable, actually. It's nice and safe. Hashtag normalize jars. <laughs> I will win my jar movement. Jars will become normal again. You can't change my mind. <laughs> you can't. I was told not to break them off. Okay, good, 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 good. Oof. Oof, I was, uh, oh, I was quite nervous there. But I think we're safe. I think the uh, gods are feeling rather benevolent today. For now, oh lord. Hello, Dark of Last. I'm doing well, thank you. How are you doing? Stopping on by, we're just about to start the game, so perfect timing, really. It's loading up. Oh, this already looks so good. Just by like the cover art. I wish I could rewire my breed when I hear the word Among Us. Why? What's wrong? It was good to hear you for Wesker you'd expect from Raven. Oh lord. Oh lord. Yes, that can be a bit uh, terrifying. <laughs> I sent a message on our Discord group. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Thank you, Fortune. Absolutely, because that was such a blast. You finding those mods like that. Oh my gosh. Uh, okay. So, the game is up. Don't be big like that. Get into your corner. Don't be difficult. There we go. She said among us. She said among us. My new mod pack is 60 mods now. Because after oh lord it is, isn't it? Okay, yeah. Uh, actually, I'm going to make this... I'm going to put 18 plus in my chat. Because it is... As far as I'm aware, it's got quite a lot of interesting I don't want anyone to get spooked by it. I know it should have a uh, warning anyway, but just to be sure, just so some like little edgy 13 year old doesn't come in. I don't think they can handle it. Since the shape question be gone before I do anything, I'll just tell you, West Coast gonna take end up being a friend. I'm not reading that. Warning. The game contains disturbing images and scenes of explicit violence, gore, self-harm, sex. Harassment, animal cruelty, body horror, mental illness, flashing images. These are presented through the creative thinking of Fran, a young child who undergoes trauma. The game is sprinkled with fantasy, innocence, and her endless curiosity. However, it may still be distressing to some players. The player's discretion. Yes, your warning. This is not your cup of tea, completely understandable. Okay? Of the resident evil. <laughs> resident evil. <laughs> oh, that's a throwback to that kind of music. Wait, let me just sort out the audio for you all. I think what the audio also reminds me of Americans McGee's Alice. 
How's that? Is that a good volume? The speaker now, forever hold your Reese's Puffs. Good? Get fast? I'm not hearing otherwise, so... <laughs> oh, her eyeballs. Okay, let's look at the options. So we can turn it down if needed. No reason, close effects, blah, 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 blah. Don't you need to hydrate to get my me. I guess we'll just go straight into it. Well then. Well, thank you everyone for being here. I hope you're doing incredibly well. Uh, we're about to jump in and play some Fran Bao. Or bow? 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 Well, well, How would you say well. this? Oh, hello! What have we here? Coconut PNG! Oh, I'm really scared! Thank you for the follow! How are you doing? I do. I'm doing full screen. Maximized window. There we go. That way I can tab out and it won't disturb everything. Never mind, it still does. Oh well. Right, take a sip of my coffee. I know, like I said, it's not tea time yet, it's coffee time. I need I need the uh, I need the goods. And without further ado, let's start the game. Well, okay, well after it tells me that we use an autosave feature. Everything's fine. It feels like heaven. I see my parents, and they look happy. They have a present for me. I wonder... Ah! It's a cat! Oh, so sweet and pretty. Dark as the deepest night. It's Mr. Midnight! That's adorable. My best friend. My only friend. Oh. We're having dinner, and I see Aunt Grace, too. I really like her a lot. It's Friday. My parents are going out. Aunt Grace takes good care of me. Oh, look at him licking his little milks. We're having so much fun. <laughs> it's Monday night. I'm playing with Mr. Midnight. But something feels real bad. Oh, it's a goat man. A strange creature outside of my window. I don't like it. It scares me. And suddenly I hear something. It's mum. Screaming. I want to know what's wrong. A bright light shines from my parents' room. I go closer. And closer. <laughs> this is not the time for foodie woodies. There's a marrow there! Mum? Dad? Please don't. My. Mummy? That he? Well, that's a bit of a bloody mess. Oh. Oh, the kitty. <gasps> kitty, don't go. Hey, good. Kitty. My goodness, indeed. Fran, please follow my voice. 
On the count of three, you'll wake up. One. Two. Three. Or maybe if I don't click out. Varan, how do you feel? Oof. Oof. Okay, so I'm going to have I'm going to remove the bottom banner because they as you can see there's game options. Or I could shrink it a little. Um I'll just remove my banners. Gotta figure out. How's that? Is that, is that better? Of course. Just pop myself out the way as well a little bit. There we go. Nice and snug. There you go. I'm fine, I guess. Just sad to see the same thing. The sadness is something everyone has within. I want to find the killer. I want to go home. I want to find the killer. I really want to know who killed my parents. The police are working on it. I'll find my cat and the killer. Your cat is missing. It would be impossible to get him back. But now I have something for you, Fran. Oh, really? See the desk? There's a little package for you. It's from Aunt Grace. Take it. But well, where is she in all of this? You can give me some bloody help would be nice. This was my mother's purse. The floofer says hi, they started pouring at you. Well, hello, floofer! <laughs> That's adorable. Don't tell me that. Because now I want to pet my cat. Where, where's all my cat? I hope they're not here. Open it. There's something inside. Thank you so much. Hello. How are you doing? The jelly crown. What a fantastic. The jelly crown. What are you up to? Thank you so much for the raid and welcome in. The jelly crown. Oh, I love that. How do I open this? Oh, I just click it. <laughs> Thank you so much for the raid. Welcome in, raiders. I am the Morbid Moth, a sassy British moth VTuber who sucks at games and live. Jelly raid. Oh, I love that. That's so adorable. Okay, so we have use, combined. Oh, combine. Oh, Lord. I'm going to be rubbish at this then. Use Aunt Grace letters on examine. Dearest Fran, here is the purse you like so much. I thought you would like to have it. When I was thinking about you, I remembered that you like to examine objects and combine them with other things. So I hope you'll always keep this purse and give it to all of the other things you find a good use. Never forget that creativity is absolutely the greatest gift you have. Love, Aunt Grace. Oh, where is Aunt Grace? Can she come bloody help me? It'd be quite nice. Even the trauma I'm clearly going through. Jelly, what, what are you up to? Go and have a stretch, have a hydrate, do all the things you need to do post-stream. She's worried about you. I'm worried too. I'm worried too, because I'm not crazy and I'm still here. Stop it. You're out of control, young lady. Can I go to my room now? Yes, you can leave. But before you do, it's time for your new medicine. What medicine? It's called a duo team, and it'll make you feel very relaxed. Nurse, we're ready. 
I was playing Persona, Persona 4 Golden. Ooh! I'm yet to play a Persona game, but I keep hearing incredibly good things about them. How do you like Fan Bow so far? I don't know if it's, it's a power bow. <laughs> Saying it wrong, Franbo. Franbo. Um, we've literally only just started it, but I love Little Misfortune, so I'm already sold by the fact it's fun. So <laughs> Anything new today, Dr. Dean? Nothing actually. The same visions as before. Theo, Bo. Mm. No. Oh, I see. Here, Fran. Take your medicine. Can I click on anything else? No? Okay. Munch munch. Oh, how did she take that dry? Have some water. I don't feel good. No wonder it's going to give you heartburn if you take it dry like that. I don't feel good. Oof. Giblets. <laughs> take her back to her room. And nurse, don't let her take this ever again. Oh, well, at least they're concerned. In, in a nice way, it seems, for now. Beware, Franbo. If you leave the house of madness, I will hunt you down, at you. And bring you back to insanity. Oh, and wake up. The medicine will help you escape. I'll be waiting for you in the forest. I love you. Yeah. Oh, you can't tell me to try. I mean, I can try properly voice acting. I'm just doing like little fun ones, but I can try. <laughs> oh, I hate these. Why does anyone have these clowns? It's not even that I dislike clowns. I just don't like these pictures. They're just ugh. <gasps> Dakaman, hello. Welcome in. How are you? I'm still here. A hideous place. I have to get out of here. Case blah, 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 blah. Name Fran Bo Dagenhard. Age 10. Gender female. History. The patient was found near the Oswald Asylum showing signs of psychosis. The Bo Dagenhard family tragedy. Details admitted. Treatment. Dr. Marcel Dern has tried different medications and all have been cancelled because of the side effects. This game was set in England around the same time as the misfortune. Really? True. <gasps> that's pretty cool if that's the case. July 25th, 1944. No. Good to be curious. I'll get your nose. I'll get it. Are you a happy clown? Can you make me laugh? I'm having a hard time laughing again. I should get the key for this. They're still closed. Locked. Hopefully this won't fall on my head while I'm sleeping. <laughs> That's exactly what I was thinking. That's quite heavy to be up there. Oh, sweet, sweet melody. One more time. La la la. It does the same as before. Oh, holy moly, something fell. Hmm. A handy hook. I'll save it to play pirate later. Well, I guess I broke the curtains. Now I can look outside. I mean, you could have just moved the curtains, but sure. Is Little Miss Fortune and Fran Bow connected? Really? Ooh, that's cool. A tower defense. We have a crazy person for you called Fran. Or is it defense tower? Um, I guess that is my way out. I don't think my head would fit through the window. I don't 
want to. I just woke up. <laughs> Scary nightmares? No thanks. What we got here? Red, what is it? Red? Oh dear, I miss you so much. What is that? Red and tiny, you are hiding from me. Hate the monster. I have to find Mr. Midnight. I have to find him now. I miss my kitty. He hides because he is afraid. He told me that the medicines would show me where he is. I can still walk around it and see what's on the other side. They are connected because the creature that literally just threatened to bring Fran back to his dungeons is the same type of creature as Mr. Voice. Really? Okay, that's cool. Oh, I like that. Oh. What's the other side, though? What's this side first? The nurse's station. Okay. Oh, we can't go any more this way, though. My legs are just fine. Um, I'm not disabled. Empty bottle, empty glasses, nothing useful. Towels? Towels? I don't need towels. What was I out to this window? Well, that's miserable. Why is it boarded up? Um, not so easy to see through this. Is that the playground? Maybe somebody already tried jumping through this window. You get to see multiple things in here that you see at the end of Misfortune, and there's a few references to the other worlds. Okay, that's... I mean, that's so... Like, I love it when things like that connect. Like, not massively, but just enough that you're like, ooh, I see, you know, the theming of the world and stuff. Yeah, <sighs> playground. Good night, trees and moon. Um, I like the bunny swingy thingy. It makes me feel dizzy. I'm pretty sure the playground isn't a good escape route. Hello, nurse. Oh, I want to know what she's writing. I'm curious. I guess the nurse won't ever let me touch anything. Oh, Fran, you're awake. Good. How long was I asleep? Uh, three days, maybe. Was it the medicine that made me sleepy? Yes, it was the medicine. That's why you're not taking it again. Well, I forgot. Something happened. Say you're nothing but trouble. What is it? Well, I was trying to look outside and I accidentally broke the curtains. Accidentally? <sighs> I'll have to fix this. Follow me. Shout out. And sleep. There we go. How are you? What are you up to? How did your stream go? I hope it went well. I love this game and excited you're playing it. I literally know nothing about it, although I have been told that it apparently links to the misfortune, which is really cool. Like, I'm down for that. <laughs> The devs are making a third game, likely to contain similar themes, and it's likely going to be... Oh, don't tell me that. Now I'm invested. Don't get me invested in things. <laughs> oh, gosh darn it, how dare you? And something is missing. I've seen the hook that holds the curtains up. What's a hook? Well, I have to go find something to fix this, you little girl. Well, that's a shame, isn't it? Now, what are you writing? 
Unfortunately, every time I tab out, the music stops, so I do apologize. I think this is where the medicine is, but it's locked. My goodness, this is terrible. Meow. <laughs> You're cute. I, I mean, stop it. No, you. Why would the nurse have this? I'll leave this as it was. I really need to get out of this place. Oh, I'll keep these patches to stop bleeding. Ew. Violent trauma can have great impact on children, totally changing their normal lives. For example, children damaged by trauma can have mild to severe de deficits in some abilities such as trusting people near them, seeing the world as a safe place, making decisions, etc. Because of these effects, some Hensley, <laughs> thank you so much for the gift you stopped to me. Thank you very much. Thank you, that's very kind of you. Nurse, this is going to be uniform, beautiful, but frosty, honestly. <laughs> Because of these effects, some traumas can lead to several symptoms of major mental illness, for example, not trusting other people or not feeling safe. This can be interpreted as paranoia, frontal lobe, motor cortex, sensory cortex, parietal lobe, occipital lobe, and temporal lobe. Oh my lord, am I supposed to read this? This nurse's handwriting is awful. I only understand three words. Fran, sleeping, and duotine. Let's see if I can see. Gladys something, Fran Bow. The patient has... Mm, something sleeping. Has The patient has been sleeping almost three days. Uh, three days time. She uh, only wakes up to, some, to, to drink water. But I don't think she remembers that. After drinking, she goes to sleep again. She hasn't been social for three days now. Some kids have come around and asked about her and when she would come out and play. You look team. 8H. And then use. So now it's 8 hate. This game, yes. I presume the game first due to be made before Little Miss Fortune, but could be reversed. I'm not sure what order they'd be in, but this is definitely the first one, isn't it, they made, so. Ooh, a secret box. Shh. A wooden box. It's open. The key. This will certainly open something. Would that open my drawer? It, and there's something inside. Uh, exam. Oh. Grace did it, calling it. <laughs> my dear family, I will guard this with my life. I miss you so much. I really need you here with me. I will find my kitty and then go to you, Aunt Grace. I know Aunt Grace will take good care of me and Mr. Midnight. I wish my parents were alive. Aunt Grace, calling it. Now so we got hooks. Oh, cute hair clip. I like that hair clip. I hope somebody loves you. Hello again, Mr. Teddy. I used to have a blue dress like yours. I can't play with you now. I'm on a very secret mission. Fillmore Bronstone, age eight, gender male. Fran Bow, though, bleh, and he's at Fran Bow is said 49 years before Miss Fortune. 14? Bloody hell. History. The patient came to Oswald Asylum with his mother, Rachel Bronstone. The boy has developed paranoid behavior. Paranoia not yet diagnosed. Treatment. Daily treatment of Dr. Marcel Dern. You have not achieved the patient's trust, and he refuses to be questioned. 6th, 1944. Oh, 
wooden Mr. Horse. Are you having a good time? Back and forth. Back and forth. Oh my goodness! The trip of our lives. Yeah. <laughs> So much of the fun I will welcome in. Well, I'll make well, well. you okay? What have we here? Bistief. Ah, oh, I'm really scared. Thank you for the follows. Welcome in, everyone. I am the Morbid Moth, a sassy British moth VTuber who sucks at games and life. We are playing some Frando. Huh? I said it right that time. I said it right this time, chat. Well, well, well. <laughs> oh. What have we here? A secret of a chill. Oh, I'm very scared. Thank you for the follow, Arctic. I'm well, afraid. Well, what well. are you up to? What have we here? <gasps> Little Poppet Six. Oh, I'm really scared. Thank you so much for the follow. Well, well, oh my gosh. Well. <laughs> Stop <have> it. <laughs> Terry Majesty. Oh, I'm really scared. Thank you for the follow. Welcome in. Welcome. Thank you so much. Oh my goodness. Watching Ada get drilled was very good. <laughs> no, don't do that. Not in front of these lovely people. <laughs> welcome and welcome and thank you so much. Hello, Arctic. Thank you so much for the raid. I hope your stream went very well. How are you doing? Welcome in, everyone. I hope you're taking care of yourselves. Thank you for the head pads. What are you streaming? What are you up to? Remember to have a stretch, have a hydrate, have a snack. Do all the things you need to do to look after yourself this wonderful day or evening. Exactly, and especially in front of these lovely people. But thank you so much for the follows and welcome in everyone. This is my first time playing this game. It does contain some mature themes and um, things such as like, you know, suicide, self-harm. So if that's not your cup of tea, that's completely understandable. You do not have to stick around at all. But as long as you look after yourself, that's all we ask for here. <laughs> so much. I'm going to, I'm very touched, goodness. So we've like I said, we've only just started this game, so you're good timing. So we've literally just woken up. All we know is that this young lady, her parents have been murdered, and she wants to find her pet cat. That's essentially where we are. Time in it, bro. You know, I tell you what, I do need a hydrate, thank you. And I, I, I actually have some squash with me this time as well. Some Vimpito. I really need to hydrate to go in my booty. There we go. Oh, hydration has been done. Make sure you do the same. You know the rules. If I hydrate, you have to hydrate. Don't make me explain it to you. <laughs> What a lovely person you are. Oh, bless you. Thank you. Not as lovely as you, I'm sure. But easily do voice acting. I mean, <laughs> I'd love to. I'd love to. Perhaps one day. <laughs> Never had the opportunity to do so, but this I, is I'm concerned. Concerned. <laughs> you you should should concerned. You should be concerned. You should be concerned. Great vibes in the stream. Oh, thank you. We do try. We do try. The death of the game is known for showing dark events from the perspective of a child. It, it, yeah, yeah, it's incredible. They've made Little Miss Fortune, if you have seen uh, that game. These are the same people. I just spaghetti, here comes the Yeti. <laughs> Can I just say what a fantastic message that is. I, I just spaghetti, here comes the Yeti. That is fantastic. Oh, brilliant. I must go. My bed needs me. Of course. You take care, player. Thank you for... Thank you. Oh, sorry, having a stretch. Yeah. Thank you so much. You take care of yourself. Right, what was she saying about this chair? <laughs> to be seated or not to be seated? That is the question. If I sit down, I'll eventually have to get up. So what's the point? Oh, sweet child. You'll know the, the joys of sitting down soon enough. The bed. A bit. Hello, Phil. Oh, the little curtsy. Oh, ho, ho. That's adorable. That was absolutely adorable. Hello. How are you? Everybody says that I'm sick. Well, they're just stupid. They always say that. 
Are you leaving tonight? Well, I will if you help me. The only thing I know is that the office is the key. The key? Is there a key inside the office? I saw the doctor write a secret code. A secret code? Open the yellow door. He doesn't want me to tell you. Who? Him. Oh? 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 Doors are closed. You're a prisoner of my game. And no one will help you escape. Leave me alone. I hate you. Okay. Mommy, Daddy, I need you so much right now. No, I won't let that monster stop me. We find the doctor's code yet? It's in the office. I imagine, is that the office or is that just the room? Of course it's locked. If I were bigger, I could knock it down. It's still locked. Can we use this? It fits, but there are two holes. I need something else. Can I combine these two together? <laughs> uh, the shape isn't right. So we, we don't actually does this stay okay no we have to remember all of this Ugh. okay eight <laughs> remember eight eight h <laughs> actually we haven't we haven't had a look at this no it's the wrong shape it needs like a downward downward bit so there's got to be something else We get the other hook? No. Is there anything we missed over here? Just the scary. Can I not pick up the knife? Okay. Well, not knife, not fork, whatever spoon. Go on, get the. There we go. Um. I think I think we've got everything, so I just need to figure out how to It must be this then. Need something else. What else have we not got? <laughs> can, can we like got the teddy? It can't be done. <laughs> just casually got the teddy. I mean, the fact that she does have a revolver in her desk is concerning. Oh, I can, can I open these? That's the only thing about point and click. You're like, what can I click? What What is the extent of my clicking? How much clicking am I allowed to do? What is the extent of my clicks? Use. There's nothing here I could use this on, really. It doesn't want anything to do with the wheelchair. Don't tell me I'm stuck already, because this is not going to bode well. Can you not get him off the wall and, like, take his hook? Not his hook, you know what I mean. The nurse writes like a doctor, for sure. <gasps> can I gut the te- can I gut the, the doll? No. Not. You have some dignity, do. I think it's not working it makes me angry. Same girl, same. Can you look through the window? Can you, like, put the chair over? Am I overthinking this? I'm very good at overthinking things. Can I just look at it? Okay, that is literally just band-aids. So this is her family, for those who have just come in. These are... This is Aunt, Aunt Grace here. I think... Is this Aunt Grace or is this her mum? I can't figure out either. One of these are Aunt Grace. <laughs> I'm, I'm pretty sure that she's the killer. So I, I, that's my, like, belief. 
no evidence to go on besides my gut. I'm good at overthinking. It's what is true though, isn't it? Normally the simplest puzzle, you know, simplest puzzles have simple solutions, but you overthink it, thus making it a difficult puzzle. I can't talk to you anymore. Would you like some plaster? Would you like a hook? <laughs> just goes up to people, just, can I gut you? Can I gut you? Can I gut you? <laughs> there's a killer. Yes, there's a killer. And I do think Aunt Grace is the killer. It's bound to be some kind of inheritance thing. Oh my good lord. Welcome in, welcome in, Raiders. Hello, hello, hello. How are you all doing? My lord, I've had a lot of raids today. I, I am absolutely honoured. Welcome in, Sin Solstice. Thank you so much. How are you doing? Welcome in, Raiders. I am the Morbid Morph. A sassy British moth VTuber who sucks at games and life. It is an absolute pleasure to have you here. And how are you doing? We are playing some Fran Bow. I've never played this game before. Um, I'm already stuck on the first puzzle. <laughs> but I'm not stuck. I'm not entirely sure what to do. I, well, yeah, that's not foodie rooting part of the cool new people. But hello, well, how was your stream? What were you doing? What are you up to? Give me all of the details. Remember to stretch, hydrate, to do everything you need to do to look after yourself. I hope you're having a wonderful night. Thank you. I hope you're having a wonderful night all day, whatever it is. How are you doing? Okay. I'm gonna read the nurse's note again. I feel like I've missed something in the nurse's note. I read it way too- oh my god, it's- wait, 8H. Oh, was this literally all it- oh, come on, no, come on! Valentine. Oh, I'm really scared. Thank you for the follow. Some quiet guy. Thank you so much for the. Oh my goodness. What have we here? Sir Bear. Oh, I'm really scared. Thank you for the follow. Welcome in. Welcome in. Something. What have we here? Fang41, Nee001, and JPZ102. Thank you so much for the follows. Welcome in, everyone. I have literally just had a raid, so. Give me a moment before I give you your shout out. How are you doing, some quiet guy? Thank you so much. The same solstice. We were just playing some Dead by Daylight all night. Pull some in frames. Oh, fantastic! Have you um have you seen the new killer, Chucky? Have you seen the animations for it? Oh, he looks hilarious. Oh, I can't wait. I'm so excited. <laughs> it's been a while since I played some Dead by Daylight, but I need to get back into it for sure. So, but quiet guy, thank you so much for the raid. How are you doing? Right, hopefully I can give you your shout out now. The cooldown should have worked. <laughs> but thank you so much. How are you? There you go. Did that work? There we go. Fantastic. I did an impromptu 11 plus hour stream. Oh my bloody hells. But did you have fun? That's the theme of today. Fun. Well, apart from, you know, the mental torments that people suffer deep inside of us all. But... We were playing him a bit before we did some survivor games. He's so much fun. Oh, he looks fun. He looks fun. Absolutely want to give him a go. What the, okay, thank you again, Sin. And thank you, quiet guy. And welcome in, everyone. Really Remember to stretch, say. hydrate, take your medicine, do your all the things you need. Concentrate on sitting straight. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. I'm a bit flustered here. 
have all caught me to rather off guard. I'm trying to figure out a puzzle, and now <laughs> and I'm getting on a barrier about it. Hang on, hang on, hang on. Big brain moment, big brain, big brain. What's, what does the box say? The box says, bear with me, bear with me. No, don't. So hide, H-I-D-E. So H-I-D-E, H-I-D-E. So, eight, nine, Eight, yeah, eight, nine, four, five. Eight, nine, four, five. Is it that simple? Is that all it is? It is. Eight, nine, four, five. Eight, nine, four, five. Really? It was there all along? You're bloody joking. <laughs> That's right. It didn't take me too long. Okay, note. Be more observant. Got it. <laughs> We played some Apex Modern Warfare 3 Zombies and Mario Kart. <gasps> oh, what a nice mixture. The good time indeed. That is what we like to hear. That is what we like to hear. As long as you're having a good time, doesn't matter what you're doing. <laughs> you're a good bean. I do, well, I do try. It costs nothing to be a good bean these days, does it? So... <laughs> It was a lot of fun. Mm -hmm. Um, all right. Well, I guess I'll take one of those. Oh! Oh? Can I talk to him now? Why are you looking at me like that? You terrify me. And see. Happiness. Hello, Mr. Deer. Oh, dear. <laughs> oh, no, your head. Oh, try and put your head back on. N no, I'm, I'm sorry I can't help you, Mr. Deer. Oh. <laughs> it was not me. Oh, well, this is fantastic. Hello, little guy. I very much enjoy the long stream. They, they are fun, aren't they? I have to say. All right, what's the I have to head for work tomorrow. I hope, of course, Arctic, have a wonderful rest. Thank you so much for stopping by. Rest well, take care of yourself. Oh, did it? Take care. Well, well, well. What have we here? Dior, Belle, oh, I'm really scared. Oh, no, I hope you enjoy your time here. Okay, Mr. Clown's missing. Who have we got out here? Oh, dear. Hello. Oh, is that my head? Give me my head back, please. Just go away, you weird creatures. <laughs> what? Are you sleeping, sweet bunny? Bunny, wake up. Please, bunny. Wake up. Oh, okay, that's cool. These are cool. Okay, well, I'm instantly in love with this game. Oh my goodness. Excuse me, nurse lady, but this may be very useful. Hello, miss nurse. Are you alright? Hello? Hello, miss nurse. Nothing there, more towels. Hello. Get out, creepy creature. What are you, huh? Tell me. Do you like to see me sad? You got a little blood in your mouth. Are you okay? My mummy also had blood in her mouth. She looked sad. Well, at least the playground's still nice, besides, you know, the handprint. I do hate to raid and dip, but I'm exhausted. I'm glad I was able to raid you. I hope you have a wonderful stream and happy times. What a thank you, quiet guy. Thank you so much. Of course, you go and get the bloody rest you would deserve. <laughs> have a wonderful sleep and do take care of yourself. Thank you so much. Have a great time zone. I love, I love that. Have a great time zone. Oh, quite, stop it, you. Oh, fuck. I can't, I can't believe, believe you've done, done this. this. I can't believe you've done this. How dare you? <laughs> Thank you so much. Well, down the Demogorgon well we go, I suppose. Okay, bye. <laughs> yeah, go, shoot, shoot. No, absolutely not. You can't tell her that. But she has to know. You can't keep me away from her. The reason is more than clear, Grace. No, it's not. I want to take her home. Now. You can't. Fran's mental condition is not stable yet. 
You don't understand her. She's a very special girl. Don't you tell me my, my giggle's adorable as well. Don't you dare. <laughs> it is not. I'm evil. Grr. <laughs> oh, wake up, Fran. Doctor has no soul. I'm going home tonight. Oh, no, Foxy Fox, don't cry. Use my hand as a tissue. Oh, ho, ho, ho. Miss Princess, would you like a hug? Why are you so sad? So I'm guessing to leave this realm, we have a sleep or something? Or we can have a look at the shadow monster. Phil is playing his uncle, and his uncle is mad. Mad! Phil is crying. Poor Phil. You see, you killed the bird. The mummy is not happy. Oh, that's the, that's the shadow creature talking. Oh, okay. She can see, like, the... Oh, interesting. Okay. Well, let's combine these two together. Oh, fantastic. My very own special key. Use it on the door. Yes, to happiness. Oh. <gasps> Who was that? I need to know more. You look like a very dapper gentleman. <laughs> you look pretty and who was that? The daddy was not there. Mummy would not care. Okay. Um. Bathrooms? What is this? Stairs. What? I wasn't here before. The shadows talk about the people's trauma. Okay. I'm down. Go to the bathroom. The king likes drawing. Somebody wrote something here. Interesting. I don't like this. Hello. <laughs> oh, my beloved friend. Bip, bip, if you want to hug me, try and catch me. Bip, bip, Can't catch me. It's because you haven't found me. Bip, bip, that's that's okay. Sure. Ooh. I don't want to touch it. It's the clown from the painting. Maybe if I touch it, it would jump and scare me. All right, nothing happened. It must be dead. A snuggle, snuggle, old lady on your chair. And your booty will be flat like your face. <laughs> Even the purest of things die in this place. Can you open the drawer? No. Who can see? A daily of food and Do I need to hydrate? Am I already sounding like I'm halfway dead? There we go. History. The patient was a victim of sexual abuse by an unknown person which almost killed her. This event has created auditory hallucinations and thought disorder. Treatment by Dr. Marcel Dern has become close enough to the patient through drawing therapy. She has made some progress. Or Where did the clown go? I hope he's not around here. Tiny, tiny hands all over you, eating your soul. Okay, casual. Why do you look like a ragdoll? They done to you. Please, somebody tell me something. You should blame yourself. Be quiet. He takes away your innocent inner child and devours it. Nobody believes you, although the wounds are bleeding. <laughs> oh. There was nothing in here at the moment. Dead inside, but are you dead on the outside? Well, another boarded up window. The maze! We never get to play there. Whoa, tonight the fog seems pretty thick. I wish I could get lost in there. So, how do we unpill ourselves? I have a feeling we might need to do that. we do it? Ah, you just click them. Okay, nice. 
Okay, so we go into Silent Hill Land, basically. Noted, noted. The throne is empty. I didn't realize that anyone could see me pooping. Gross. I can and will hold it. <laughs> and she says, oh look, it's not boarded up this time. Oh, there she is. Oh, let me see. The red puppet and a serpent. A teddy bear and many other things. Oh, real flowers. They smell so sweet. The drawer is empty. Oh, this is one of those mute clowns. I've seen so many and they all look sad. This one is very happy though. Good for him. This bed is very pink. That's mine! My crayons! Can I have it? I just like this green crayon. No, I won't be able to do green then. That's ridiculous. Oh, that's true, but you have so many other colours. Yes, many colours. But you know, they don't like me drawing. Ooh. The nurses, they tie me up, and when I want to draw, I can't. The nurses are crazy. When I can't draw, I hurt myself. Then comes the red milk. Look! Oh. Please cure me, yes. Stop the red milk. I'll see what I can do. Uh, I have some band-aids. Or plasters. Here you go. Oh. Thank you. You can have the crayon. Now go. I have to draw. Thank you. Examine. My favorite green crayon. Red milk. <laughs> I mean, it, it's certainly something, isn't it? I don't know why we have a crayon, but I guess we do. No oh, nurse. There you are. You should be in your room. The door was closed. But you left it open. I'm sure it wasn't open. I know, because I locked it. Why are you sure? You told me to go our need. Did I? Alright then, carry on. Raven, don't you dare! Wait, what was that? I don't know that one. Must have been down here. Can we open this? This gate is very locked. Some kind of alarm? I wonder what that blinking light is for. Sir Oswald Harrison, a bearded old man. I wondered why he built this place. Is regrettable. Concentrate Maybe he had a crazy child and wanted to get rid of it. Pause to check everyone, untrimp yourselves. Have a stretch as well. Have a stretch with me. Mm, good stretch, good stretch. That sign shows things are in the hospital. But what it doesn't show is how awful this place is. It should say, welcome to the most terrible place in the world. The yellow door. That's my way out. I have to open it. Oh! What? What is that message? Baldur's Gate, did you do the thing? You did the forbidden thing. You did the forbidden thing. You did the... Oh, you did the forbidden thing. You filthy cretin. Of course Raven would. Why wouldn't Raven? You absolute... How... You bloody degenerate. You did the naughty. You can't do the naughty of the bear. It's a bear! You judgmental fuzzy.
It's a fantasy world, and I can... Okay, well, Raven, you do you, hun. Um... Oh, let me save. Okay. Don't act like... No, don't do this, chat. Don't, don't support his behaviour. Don't support Raven's behaviour. You know what they're like. But welcome, invaders. I'm the Morbid Moth, a sassy British moth YouTuber who sucks at games and life. We are playing Fran Beau for the first time. It does contain some mature themes, um, such as kind of suicide, self-harm, all of that kind of stuff. So if it's not your cup of tea, completely understandable, feel free to sit this one out. Just look after yourself, okay? That's all we ask. I haven't checked my messages, Raven, because I woke up late and I had to eat breakfast and then I immediately came on stream. Did I want to see something super rad? Of course I do. Oh, have a look after stream, Raven, if that's okay. The bear is an elf. <laughs> okay. Did you expect us to be better? Well, mildly, actually, Rory. A little bit. A little bit. <laughs> Thank you for the head pads. <laughs> oh, dear. Oh, dear. Right. Um, let's see what this says. Child Psychiatry Chief, Dr. Marcel Dion. Patient visits today. So Annie hasn't been seen, Damien has, Phil hasn't, Fillmore has, Charles hasn't, Fran hasn't, Jason has, and Lisbeth has. Hey, get your hands off the office door. I can't reach these tiny windows. I could go and look through the other windows. It isn't. I want to see your reaction. Okay, okay, fine, fine. Me too. Come on then, give me two seconds. <laughs> I'm not thinking hard. I'm hardly thinking. Okay, let's have a look then. Let's have a look. Oh my day is no way. Oh my lord, Raven! Stop that. No way you made that. I will 100% share it when it's complete. Do not worry, because oh my god. <laughs> oh, Raven, thank you so much. You bet your ass I'm paying you for it. I will find a way. Thank you so much, Raven. Oh, okay, chat, you will find out eventually, but not at the moment. Hi, Tyre, welcome. Well, let's speak to this gentleman. Like this, he's there. If I call emergency, I don't think they'd help me. This table isn't interesting at all. You're not going to hear me say no, but I'm not going to give you a number. Okay, well, I'll just ask April then, roughly. <laughs> I don't even want to be near the guard. Sir, the key hanging up there. Can I have it? Sure. Grief alert, grief alert. Sure, I'm going to give you a key if you can give me a kiss. Uh. What a bastard. You can kiss your butt. I told you, a kiss for the key. What do you say, eh? I say you go shove it up your ass. The blackboard is empty. No drawings. We'll, ex we'll explore non-pilled first, and then we'll... Well, actually, is, is there a limit on how many times we can red pill ourselves? So, Raven, when you take the uh, pills, something magical happens. Ta-da! <laughs> You went to Silent Hill. There's no limit? Mm -hmm. Okay, thank you. Oh, this clock sounds odd. It feels like it's whispering right into my ear. 
I wasn't prepared. <laughs> I can't understand what it's saying. Hello up there, miss. Your dress is very pretty. My mother had a very pretty dresses too. I was just about to go to bed, Jesus woman. <laughs> Surprise, Raven. The bleeding clock. It's like time is broken and stopped. I find clocks a bit depressing. I do too. And the bleeding clock. Not so over there. Hey, dog. Yeah, it's Frambo. Oh, it's a piggy. Oh, a crunchy pig head ready to be served. I remember they were thinking about setting a limit, but I think playtesters... Yeah, I could see why. Because if you missed something, then you'd just have to redo it. I wonder who would eat this. I think my kitty would be afraid of it. Ugh, Mr. Pig is naked. Mr. Pig has no wings to fly with. No flying Mr. Pig here for me to see. A sticky, bloody parts. I don't want to touch it. I wonder what part of the body that is. Ooh, hello. Oh my god, the teddy bear. Teddy, what are you doing here? Are you on your way to meet another teddy? Say hello for me when you get there. Oh, the teddy bear. Oh, no. Oh. Raven, hi. However, speaking of this is where I leave you, fuzzy friend. Have a wonderful story. So much. Thank you, Raven. We definitely need to catch up properly soon. For sure, for sure. We definitely need to hang out again soon. Thank you so much for the raid. I hope you had a fantastic stream. Have a fantastic evening. Take care of yourself. Oh, poor Teddy. I will laugh at you. Okay. I will lie to you. I will hide you inside the shadows. Okay, fair enough. <laughs> Hello. Are you alright? What's that supposed to mean? I just wanted to know if you're feeling okay. I don't want to tell. The doctor will cut your head open if you don't leave. He likes to eat brains. He already took mine. He ate all my thoughts. He ate your brain? He'll eat yours too. I saw inside of the doctor's office. You are dead. Oh no. And I have to go. I hope you find some new thoughts. Goodbye. <laughs> She's so polite. Oh, I love Fran. I thought it was a leaf. <laughs> Ooh, okay. Good night, shiny toys. Have you seen my kitty? He is the most funny and clever guy. You would like him. Elephant, sir, you're very pink and soft. You look like you've been training at the circus. And your tummy is filled with love. Frowns on the walls in the House of Madness. You're way better inside that frame than down here, sir. It must be beautiful to make people laugh. It is indeed. It is a wonderful thing. Your tiny hat is very sweet. The smile on your face is quite scary. You don't like the clown paintings? I mean, I'm not a fan of them, no. I'm, they're just be like, they're not my cup of tea. I'm not scared of them or anything. They're just not my art taste. No worries, Rory. Rest well. Have a wonderful sleep. Thank you for stopping by. Uh, did you say something? Creepy. Uh, monkey. Would you like to help me escape? With your big muscles and hairy arms, you could break through every wall. Your accent is how I think France would have be. been. Oh, you think? And she definitely comes across as a wonderful little lady. <laughs> it was really fun. Well, thank you, Rory. You take care of yourself. Have a wonderful sleep. Action men, would either of you help me find my kitty? And the soldier lost his leg in the war. And the cowboy ate the princess. Little paper boat, take me to the sea and beyond. I wonder if this paper boat can sail. Because if it sinks, I could drown. Because I can't swim. Ooh, the pink sash is mine now. Hanging on, huh? 
Well, I don't think it fit me anyways. Why are clocks depressing? It's just the inevitable march of time, isn't it? Time is but a concept that we all constrict and restrain ourselves to, and it is very much a judgement, isn't it? But we should look less at the clocks and more at just generally enjoying the moment that we're in. Mm -hmm. Watching Ada get drilled was very good. Oh, watch Ada get drilled as well. <laughs> Hello. What are you doing? It doesn't work. The paper isn't working. What do you mean? The paper should be working like they told me. But what does the paper do? I need the paper to show me what's on the television. Oh, I see. But why isn't it working? The waves must be powerful. Change the channel, please. Okay. On cupcakes? Do you want human testing approved? Do you want ants? Ants are pretty cool. I like ants. The super hyper happy cupcake dance. No signal. News. Human testing approved. That's not news, Mr. Announcer. Oh, a documentary. Maybe? I guess it's about pine cones and ants. Still not working. Paper vision negative. Change again. What, do you want this one? No? It works! It works! It's a miracle! Thank you! Paper vision positive! Great! Can I see? No, this is mine. If you want, you could take the papers that didn't work. Oh, thank you. I suppose I could use the paper to write or draw on. I'm busy. Paper vision revision in action. Well, now I can write or draw when I'm bored. Okay, nice. As someone whose brain will just forget itself, time is a very... Exactly, time is a very weird... The guy behind... Yeah, it is a very solid finger desk, isn't it? I have a puppy needing scratches. Oh, well, Frosty, give it plenty of scratches for me. You can't just come in and tell me that you're scratching a puppy without giving the puppy scratches for me. <laughs> and Tech, hi. Glad you're feeling cozy. She won't wake up. Probably knack at the poor one. What's in here? Ooh, okay. Lots of things. The grandfather clock is big and grand. Tick tock, tick tock. It will never stop. What have we here? Chocolate. Mm, yummy. I don't like bitter coffee. The menu of the day. Hmm. Pasta. The signal is weird. It must be because we're so far away from everything. I don't really understand what they're saying. The sofa made to be sat on. I can't sit. The sofa is taken. And it smells like poo. Mummy loved to paint roses. Mummy loved to paint roses. I don't like this painting. It feels like Mr. Oswald is staring right at me. I guess Mr. Oswald is very old. Old enough to be dead. Mr. Midnight, are you here? I suppose not. Save. Yeah. I crashed out so hard from yesterday. Oh, Tech. Okay. The second I only did this way, big hugs to you. Don't worry, I'll be careful of the wings. Have a wonderful day. Thank you, Rory, and same to you. Big hugs in return. <laughs> hey, you're finally awake. <laughs> exactly, Phoenix. Thank you. What have we got here, then? I wonder if that pasta was cooked today. Not by the looks of it. The salad looks fresh for once. Milky milk. I guess the carton is all sour. Like always. <gasps> A little lemonade. I'm not that thirsty. I miss Mr. Midnight. That's the only thing I know. Anything else? Nope. What about the poor boy over here? Hello. Are you new here? I haven't seen you before. No. Are you from downstairs? Uh-huh. 
I think I'm better now. What's your name? Can you please kill me? Please. Sure. Bang. You're dead. Thank you. Can't talk now. I'm dead. <laughs> oh. Oh. Hello. Oh, hello, Fran. How are you today? I see dead animals. I'm fine. Glad to hear you're well. Carry on now. All right. Very well, Fran. Go play with your friends. What is it now? Can I borrow your magazine? No. Look, young lady, I spent all day listening to everyone's problems. It's late now and I'm very tired. Just leave. All right. Bye-bye. I won't bother you anymore. I'm sorry, miss. What's your name? My name is Blanca. Now please, go away. Please, Fran, just go away. Well, that's not very nice. She's stuck in here all bloody day. She deserves someone to talk to, too. I've ensured that the boy has received the mothy scritches. Yes! My day is content. <laughs> Sip, sip. If you're interested, consider watching the cream video by David Firth. Okay. I will put it on my watch list for sure. Birdie Bird, I like you. I wish you could take me out of here. Can you? Fly away. What are you waiting for? Where'd that girl go? Alright, lady. Can I talk to you? Aww. Hey, Annie, how are you? Aren't you afraid of me? No, why would I? Because I could do magic tricks and make you sleepy. Magic tricks? I didn't know you could. Show me. Show you, but it's scary. It's better if you do it. I can't. I'm not a magician. I can give you the magical stuff. Really? Yes, the magical stuff that will make anyone fall asleep. Oh, that's amazing, powerful and grand. Here, it's a gift. Take it. Slowly. Right, how does it work? You cool, oh, Mathie. I can't, I can't believe, believe you've, you've done, done this. this. <gasps> Sinful rat! Thank you so much. I can't believe you've done this. Thank you for the cakes. That's very kind of you. <laughs> Fran's like eight. I think, yeah, Fran's ten, I believe it said in her, in her little thing. All right, thank you so much. And thank you for the head pass, Rory. Okay. We have a magical pill. Nice. What's out this window? Playground again. I would imagine this is also the playground. Yep. Yeah. Another for funsies. Oh, oh, you can't just do that for funsies. I can't believe you've done this. <laughs> Thank you, Sinful Rat, for the more case. <laughs> Thank you very much. Thank you. For the funsies, honestly. How dare you? Don't touch my sword. I didn't know it was yours. You should bow and speak clearly to me. I'm your king. Oh, I bow to you, sir. Very well, my child. What's the purpose of your visit? I want your walking cane. What walking cane? You mean my sword? Yes, your highness, your sword. What would you give me in exchange? Anything you need, your highness. Bring me a castle and a horse. Only then will I grant you my sword. A friend is small, precious, and traumatized. That's fine. Yeah. Not we all. <laughs> I want to cuddle tiny one to spend the night in his bed. Of course, like I said, Rory, go and have a rest. And thank you for the hydrate. Heck, thank you for the hydrate. 
I'm starting to pass out, but I hope you have a lovely rest of your night, Morbid. It was a pleasure catching you. Thank you so much, Sin Songs. Of course, thank you so much. You have a wonderful rest. Please take care. And thank you again so much for stopping by. An absolute delight. Thank you. Annie loves to drink milk like a kitten. But sadly, she's not my cat. I'm going to miss her. I guess she won't remember me. This door's always locked at night. I can't go out and play. I guess I have to wait till tomorrow, but that's absurd. I have to find my kitty. Okay. Can I just... There we go. I was about to say, can't I just draw one? <laughs> the king likes drawings. Mm -hmm. Oh! Thank you, Frosty. Aww. Oh, that's beautiful. Exactly what I dreamt of. You can take my sword now. It's yours. Yay. I don't know. Can I combine it with this? Oh my god, I can! <laughs> that was a complete whim. A prettier walking cane. A cane decorated. I don't know what I'd use that for, but sure. Um, I guess we can go back and do some... Do some pills. Where are you off to? Where are you off to, Annie? Can I whack this guy over the head with the cane? He deserves it. Do you even drew an apple tree? I know, right? Attaching the hook to the cane, you reckon? Oh! Now I can reach high. I'll call this the Grabomatic 2000. Good call, good call, Phoenix. Big brain. We've got shoes, but no one else does. Where are you off to? Or are you just wandering? Okay, I think you just wander. I just wanted to make sure. Hill time. Nom nom nom. I like the Among Us background music. <laughs> oh, this is a bit different. Oh dear. Well, he got a bit excited. Hide your pain. Oof, truth or. Oh, she's being like stroked to sleep. Oh, that's weird. Wake up, Isabel. The black shadow is touching you. It says you're going to die soon. Are you afraid of death? I hope not, because it might happen even though you don't like it. Oh no, they did it all wrong. They cut your head into little pieces. Please take me out of here. Please take me out of here. Thank you for the hydrate. And Concentrate on sitting straight. Thank you for the first time chat. Welcome. Right, thank you for the posture and the hydrate. Chat, this is your hydrate and posture check. This is for all of you, so you don't lose your head like this poor boy. That looks mind-blowing. Frosty, please. Frosty. <laughs> Frosty, please. Emotional damage. Oh, there's a little shadow thing here. No, it's the same thing. Ooh. Um... I think I see something. Or not. Look at me. 
I say you're beautiful. Will I give you poison to eat? Okay, well, nothing of interest really in here besides, you know, murder. The clown go! I ask a favor. What's up, Panda Witch? The grandfather clock is big and grand. Stop ticking, though. Anything here? No? Hello, nurse. Oh, no. The nurse lady died. I wonder who did this. It wasn't me. She smells real bad. It feels like the smell's all over me. They hide you because they love you. They harm you because they hate you. Oh, little boy. Everyone's ashamed of you. Loki? If my husband is hiding in this chat, can you send him to bed? It's 5am. <laughs> I don't think he is hiding in this chat. Let's have a look. <gasps> they are hiding! Wait. You know who you are. I won't call you out. But go to bed. It's 5am. Sleep. It's 5am. Go to bed. You know who you are. I am shaming you publicly without saying your name. But go to bed. Okay? Don't make me DM you. <laughs> I hope that helped. Thanks. Anytime, girl. Anytime. <laughs> That holy man took all your clothes off. Oh no! Oh, how pretty all of the roses are, right? Your mummy doesn't believe you? Please tell me if you can hear me. Why do you have this creature next to you? He's staring at you. Maybe he wants to eat you. Ugh, it's alive! If Kitten were here, he'd probably attack it. I hope it doesn't start following me. Door is locked. Okay, so what do we have? We have the hook. So I wonder if we can reach anything. What? I remember this was this TV room. We need to. I feel like we could get the keys, but we need to get rid of him. Oh, we've got the we've got the magic. Th oh, here you go. Negative. No. Why not? Hey, hey, hey! Give me that. You can't take the key. But I worked hard on it. It's my grabomatic. Give it back. Shut up. You don't read the rules. I do. This toy of yours will stay with me from now on. You bastard! I will get it back. I will. Do whatever you want. I will not leave this chair. Look, girl, if you keep coming here, I won't be able to control myself. Ah. Why do you keep coming to me? Do you love me? I told you, a kiss for the key. Okay, I want to get him some kind of drink and put this pill in it. That's my plan. That's my plan. You've got your, your. I think I'm done. I'm pretty, think I'm pretty much done upstairs. It's a bad time to mention I've been awake since before yesterday. Oh, spreadsheet, go and get some sleep. Oh, my lovely. I hope you're not overdoing it. A little lemonade. Right. Um. Oh, what about the coffee? Aha! Uh -huh. No! Nothing. And I told you, go mind your own business. We can't just do the loop.
What if we put it in this boy's food? Will she then, like, go and help him? What about... Oh, this guy's eating, isn't he? Oh, or do we put it in her milk? No? I guess if Damien eats the pasta, it can't be that bad. It's definitely something to do with along about its lines. What about these? Ah! Hmm, I can see the cinnamon button melting in my mouth. Then we- there we go. Oh, this is a magical cake now. A sleepy sleepy cake. Or as the internet would say, a sleepy EP cake. <laughs> Save, just in case. I don't want any trouble, so I bought this cake for you. I'm not interested in taking anything that comes from you. Please take it, and it'll make your life a bit sweeter. I don't care about making my life sweeter. And leave. But why not? Take it! No, now leave me alone. Well, no, take it. Rude, why do you not want my cake? Take my cake. Take it. Okay, fine. Who can I give this to then? Do you like it? Would. Oh, hello. I told Marcel about the latest delivery, but he hasn't looked at it yet. Well, it'll catch up soon. Hey, Gladys, would you do me a favor? Sure, anything but bring coffee to the guard. Why not? I can't do it because I have to take care of the children. I have other things to do myself. Sorry. There we go. Oh, goodness. Sorry, lovely fingers. The coffee's hot. I will sleep tonight. Okay, Spurgeon, make sure you do. I want to see how this game goes. Besides, it has top tier voice. <laughs> no, it does not. Stop it. <laughs> Thank you. Okay, so we've got the cinnamon roll and the coffee, so... Can I borrow your magazine yet? No, I don't think so. Okay, well, let's go and take the coffee then. Here's your hot, hot coffee, sir. Oh, add a girl. Add a girl, look at that. Serves him bloody right. Look what she did, you insane orphan bitch. You did that on purpose. Now I have to go change. Ugh, it burns like hell. Don't go anywhere, you little shit. Uh huh. Come back to your great creator. And now we can get the keys. Got you. Now we can unlock the office. I don't know if we're timed or not, but let's give it a go. Okay, I'm just gonna save just in case we're like limited. I don't know. We, we should be okay. I wonder what people do with those gatherings. It's a lovely painting. I wish I could draw like that. Testing day. Every day is testing day. October and November. I guess we're in October now. Tiny text. Thoughts of Marcel Dean. Um, an interview about Dr. Dean about working with children. You are not alone. Join us today, Oswald Asylum. Dr. Marcel, turn off the alarm for the security panel. Ooh. December 17. What? Equals... 7, July 20, December 17 and July 25th. What? December 17th, oh, I don't know, we'll figure it out. No, I've seen this before. What does it mean? I hate this bed. I'm not laying down here. I've cried so many times here. I really don't know what this is. All air comes out of it, like the wind. I guess there's a hole behind it. A wind hole! 
know I love to open mail, but this isn't for me. The yellow typewriter. I could write a letter to Aunt Grace. Dear Aunt Grace, get me out of here, please. The books are all the same. I wonder whose head that is. Vision, taste, and hearing. I learned some of this at school. I don't remember it all. The brain is so complicated. I don't even understand all of my thoughts. Yes, nobody does completely. Um, the doctor ate an apple. I could use this as a helmet to prevent injuries when I faint. But I guess my hair does a good job too. No pictures or funny riddles. Mr. Midnight could tell me a riddle. He loves them. This book is not interesting. The doctor used to sit here and do nothing. Always good to carry an extra key. I wish this key holder had all of the keys. Okay, what do we have? We could just leave this on his desk. Oh, I thought that was gonna let me then. I was like, why no way? <gasps> Frosty, hello! How are you? Oh, let me stretch. Yum, 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 yum. And Thorgrim, hello, hello, welcome in, welcome in. How are you both doing? I hope you're doing fantastically well on this fine, fine morning. You're slightly sick? Oh no, Frosty, don't say that. Look, it's fine. Look, see, everything's fine. <laughs> it's fine. Brother. Need to open the gate in front of the yellow door. What have we here? Dream Demon 1197. Oh, I'm already scared. Thank you for the follow and welcome in, welcome in, welcome in. I hope you enjoy your stay. There can only be one Frosty. Frosty off. <laughs> Battle for the Frosties. It's 5.14 a.m. but I have a meatball sub. Oh. I mean, what have a better time to have a meatball sub, to be fair? Are you, is there double audio on the alerts? Oh, it's probably because I've got my desktop audio and my alerts on. I do apologise. Nothing different on here. Oh, that dead girl looks a bit like me. Well... I'm sedated and I see weird stuff, but I'm not dead. I can breathe and talk and do all the things a living person does. Even though your eyes are open, you can't understand. Probably not. Anything else? No? Okay. Uh-oh. Phil? Forgotten girl with no family or cat will die when the moon arrives. What do you mean? What? Uh, rude? Uh, Phil, please let me out. I shouldn't scream. If they find me, I'm in big trouble. Where did I put the key? The key doesn't work here, though. Phil, please let me out. Hmm. Rockland, we go. Ah, we can open it. Are you an insane? I think I think we are. I think we're doing okay. Possibly. We'll team up to freeze the competition. Oh, Frosty. Oh, it's the wind hole. I wonder if Phil knew something about this. Reticus! That rat really hit its head. I should give it a helmet. <laughs> what do you mean, stinky? You're the stinky one, Frosty. Don't give me that. You should know that by now. I shall get comfy and be a lurky lurk, but all the love and thanks to the stream if I do. Oh, cool spread. Please get some rest. I'm asking you to get some rest. Please get some rest. Thank you so much for the lurk. 
Careful, Fran. No! Oh dear. Where am I now? Well, I guess I'll have to find out. A mop that dances on the floor. Mr. Midnight hates mobs. He always tries to kill them with his furious paws. You should, you should be concerned. concerned. You should be concerned. Ah, oh, cleaning products. Putting A together <laughs> was very good. Damn it, Shepard! Sponges and washcloths and thousands of chemicals. I don't think I need any of these. <laughs> I'm in it for a fuck's sake. Although I do need to hydrate. So thank you for that frosty. Oh my god! Right, you're just bullying me now. Look, a sink. No water to wash my hands. Don't you hee hee me. Oh, speaking of, when are you going to make the thing that we were talking about? Mm hmm? I want to join it and come terrorize people. <laughs> Hi, Herbert. <gasps> Hi, Herbert. Thank you. Thank you for blessing me with Herbert. The box is open. Let me see. Ooh. I'm in it for fuck's sake. The gloves tell me nothing. All nurses wear gloves. A scraped label. The bottle is empty. I guess I'll put some pills in it. Ugh, bad pills. Just take them to find my kitty. Yellow pills. They look more fun than the red ones. I wonder why I get red instead of yellow. Maybe they just ran out of colour. This is concerning. concerning. Oh, oh my. You should be concerned. God damn it. Could try and take it, but I don't want to. I'm behaving today. A shepherd, you never behave. Don't give me that. It's gonna be a bit because some people will be able to draw until next year. Some. Oh! Oh, okay. Very exciting. No worries, Frosty. Old and rusty. I guess I'll have to place to sleep as I can't find the way out. There's nothing under the blanket. Oh, if I were a witch, I could fly away from here. I'd fly with my kitty, where the night is filled with shining stars. And we'd visit curious places because we both like curious things. Okay, but pill time. Oh dear. <laughs> Lives in a box. No, lies in a box. Gotcha. You really lose your head in this place. Hopefully I can escape before I lose mine. <laughs> I'm doing art so you're s I'm safe today. Oh, good. Unless I decide to draw it. Oh, no. <laughs> Hello, guys. A good one. Oh, thank you, and to you. Rest well. Thank you for popping in. It's locked. Oh dear. If you struggle, you'll know that is I. I've been in every corner to make you suffer and cry. If you choose to disobey, your cat's life will be marked. Oh. oh, my dear kitty. We'll be together again soon, I promise. I miss you, my dear. I miss you so much. Why are you leaving? Please don't leave me alone, Mr. Midnight. Oh, don't make me go to the maze. At the end of the maze, Fran. Me. I could barely never get my way through bloody linear space, let alone. <laughs> Hello, Gabna. Hello, Gabna. Oi, oi. <gasps> Dear, hello, and a good morning to you. How are you doing? Is that the icon of sin? A hey, yolk. <laughs> They ask you how you are. You just can't get into it because they would never understand. Why am I seeing my emote? Hello, Frosty. <laughs> What's a beautiful emote, Fang? What are you on about? 
Dueling December. That's good. That's a good. I like that. Dueling December. Yeah, you want a motivation. Everything that's going on, you want a motivation. The absolute. Yeah, of course I can. Of course I can. Let's give you that motivation. The motivation courtesy of dear. Oh, yeah, this is the other one we had. Please try staying. Thank you. <laughs> the motivation courtesy of dear is. Feeling happy? Consume. I mean, that could be taken in many different ways, couldn't it? Are we having a nice snack? Are we consuming media? What, 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 what's going on? <laughs> Either way, that is a very ambiguous one. Thank you for that existential crisis there, dear. Very much appreciated. Consume. All right, I'm a lurk. No worries, James. Thank you for the lurk. Consume more lamps. Okay, now we're talking. Ah, I fainted again. I wonder if my dreams are true. The monster won't let me go home. But if I find the maze, maybe I can find Mr. Midnight. I'm going to consume. Consume that booty. Dear, honestly. How dare you. How dear dare you. How dear dare you, dear. <laughs> Operating room. Patient, Robert. Quack. Don't you quack me. Robert Clark. Psychosurgery procedure, lobotomy. Oh no! Don't do lobotomies. Lobotomy bad. Observation. Failed anesthesia. Hello, Governor. Hello, hello, Shepherd. Failed anesthetic. Owies. The patient woke up after reaching frontal lobe. The procedure was cancelled and incomplete. Okay, good. Whew, but still, good lord. Ah! Grab, 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 grab. The operating room. I don't want to go inside. It smells like rotten flesh. I don't want this play of my head in there. Oh. No, poor girls. I hope they get well soon. I hope I never end up like that. I won't if I leave this sick place and find Mr. Midnight. Oh. It was cancelled. Oh, poor fellow. This is 1944, where lobotomies are thought to be generally helpful. Oh, yes, I know, I know. But alas. Hello, are you resting? Did you puke? That's disgusting. Well, I hope you get well soon. Rudy, Rudy, me. Oh, so I did go all the way around. You know what time it is. Um, num, num, num. Oh my gosh, hello. <laughs> hello there. You can't blame those who are ignorant. But you can't let ignorance decide. Life will teach you even through pain and tears. My path to life has been denied. I haven't been born. I was alive. I'm waiting for mother to love me. It would. It would. The ra. Draw. Draw tea. Or it would. Draw tea or do something like that. Draw it, I would imagine it says. Good oh boy. Why do you have your brain out? Is it too warm in there? He won't answer. I guess the mice will come and have some meat. It says it would, or draw it. I don't know what that means. I haven't got any paper though. So no head. <laughs> oh, shaken baby syndrome. Yes, they took the new one upstairs. Bo? No, I haven't seen her. 
What? The key to the cellar? Well, no. And the doctor's office? He used to keep the key there. Calm down, the key isn't here. Sure, I'll let you know if it turns up, but you must calm down. Yes, yes, I'll bring it to you if I find it, alright. Goodbye. Oh my goodness, I can't believe this. I'm at the reception already. This is grand. But the nurse, I have to get rid of her. What should I do? <gasps> and that's what we put the sleepy bun for. How do we give her the sleepy bun? Just leave it there? Do we go off and give it to her? Hmm. I got the alarm over there. Okay. She doesn't want to go in there. Can't do anything else in here. Don't need any of. Oh, the paper! The patient blah, 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 is our current target. Target response is positive, now extending the triggered gland. Ectoplomatonin dose is up 1700 mcg. The change in container, so it looks like an approved variant. So that, that number is Fran, I'm pretty sure. I hate that I'm up early for a weekend. Oh, Frosty. Well, if you want to do anything, let me know. I'm free all day. So if you wanted to, like, play some Fortnite and stuff. Or do anything else. Or, like, bread and fred. Just let me know. If not, go and be productive. <laughs> I'm struggling with the post. Shepherd, you cheeky sausage. Can I give you... Can I, like, open the hatch? <gasps> Rex, hello! Nom nom nom. How are you? Oh, bonjour. Oh, you're all skinny. Yuck. Are you a nurse too? Why are you hanging up there? At the end of the maze. That's exactly what Mr. Midnight told me. I wonder what's at the end of the maze. Whatever it is, I hope I find my kitty. I can't remember Aunt Grace's phone number. I'll just surprise her when I get home. I'm a love letter. Dear Pete. Ugh, gross. Hmm, I don't want to be here anymore. I'm wasting time on a sofa, thinking. When my poor little cat is freezing outside. The key holder has no keys to hold. If only the key holder could talk. That would be a rare talking piece of wood. Can I give it a key? There you go. And there you go. Hope the nurse sees the key. Some wires up there. Nothing about it? Okay. Once I have breakfast with my parents- Oh, sure, Frosty! I'll teach you French. I love your bonjour. <laughs> but I, I attempt. I attempted. <laughs> the key was here after all. And I better take it back. Yeah, get out of here. Get out of here. You're the cinnamon bun. <laughs> So we can open the door, but we need to do the alarm code. Uh, which was... December 17th, July 25. 1725 then, maybe? The yellow door would remain over two minutes and then reactivates. 
12, 17? No. O seven two five? No, there's no O. Um Where was the cal where was the calendar? That was that was that in the it was in the office though. We can't, we can't get to the office. Was it down here? Equals this that's twelve and seventeen, and seven and twenty five. on my screen get off what what how did you even get into my room get off my monitor weirdo equals oh don't make me do maths is it asking me to add them up 12 17 Seven and twenty-five. Uh -huh. So it's twenty-nine thirty-two. I don't bloody know. Here we go. Yeah. Oh, thank God. Oh, that was a complete guess. Oh my goodness. I mean, <clears throat> yes, really calculated. Oh, went according to plan. Easy. <laughs> and would it be part of your stream? Well, can he not? I've knocked him off. He's on my desk now. He can have a wander around my desk. That's fine. No reason to kill him. Okay, so we've got about two minutes before the alarm goes off again, so just leg it. Leg it! Uh oh. You little bitch! We'll make you pay for what you did! Uh. Okay. Oh dear. You clever little girl. You think you can just leave? Uh, excuse me, what? It can't be. No! Oh, it's Mr. Midnight! <gasps> it's Mr. Midnight like Mr. Fox? Is he like Benjamin? Need to get back to the maze. Is he Benjamin 2.0? Hello? Okay, this is cool. We walk on the leaves? Huh? 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 Oh, let's not walk into those. Oh, this is cool. Oh, not that way. Oh, quick run! I hope I'm not missing anything. I can't open my inventory or anything, so I think we're okay. Mushrooms, statues... You're so fast! You're too fast! 
I've got little legs, come back. Well, you've zoomed off again. You just let him in a big circle. Gee whiz, thanks. Wait for Mr. Ghosty to pass. I wonder what the are saying as well. They must be saying something. I think it's definitely something your soul. Right. There's the other bridge. Ooh. Almost. Gonna wait for him. There we go. That was a waste of time. Fantastic. That's what we like. No, don't. Don't do it. No murder. No murder. Okay, good, 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 good. And what's an upwards? Oh dear. Hide. Look at Naha. At the end of the maze, you will find the evil critters of the night. They will haunt you. They will laugh. But there will always be a good side. A cat full of nuts and bolts will always be your guide. Oh no, the photo! Add a girl. Add a girl. Chapter 2, Part 1. Curiosity Symptoms. Ooh! Let me have a stretch. <sighs> My goodness, that was close. I hope the guards don't find the sewer. Oh, what is this place? I hope I find Mr. Midnight soon. Quick, save! Ooh, okay, well, I am enjoying this. I'm just going to have a very quick break, though, stretch of the legs, go and take care of Lottie and all of that. So I won't be a moment. I hope that's okay with you, chat. I hope that's okay. I hope that's okay. I googled and says nothing about the whispers. Okay, a phoenix. Okay. At least it's, it's not like something we're missing, so to speak. Thank you for googling that, though. All right, so very quick break. I'll be back in a moment. Go and get a snack. Go and have a drink, etc., cetera, etc. Cetera. Uh, no writing in chat. Not more than what you usually do, of course. <laughs> You're filthy really degenerates. Exactly. Uh, <laughs> this, this is, is my, my boob. It does booba things. Stinky poopy! Whoa, whoa, whoa! We don't need to see. Whoa! Excuse me. Well, that was traumatic. Hey, my gosh. Uh, it is by someone called N-E-N-4-B-A. There's no point in me trying to pronounce that because I would butcher it. Sig, I'm not playing League. Go to bed. It's way past your bedtime. <laughs> 
Mummy Moth tells you to go to bed. <laughs> Wait, no. <laughs> Everyone ignore the fact I just said Mummy Moth. Okay? <laughs> no. <laughs> oh, goodness. I don't like that at all. No. I'm going to get cancelled. I'm going to get cancelled. I'm going to do a completely controversial take. Four, Good little fun one. That's my nickname four, for you, five. Sarah. <laughs> and Dev's are lending us a hand. Oh my gosh! I hate you both. One for the pun, and the other for the. <laughs> Shut up, Sarah. I'd give more than. Just <laughs> Sarah, you come in here instantly. My chat turns into de degenerates. What is this power you contain, hmm? Oh, what are we doing? I'm at the break. Ah, okay. Yep, yeah, my body. Look, okay. We're not going to be here for very long because you're all filthy degenerates. But this is my booba. It does booba things. Okay. <laughs> oh no, there we go. <gasps> oh no, it's the stinky poopy. Whoa, whoa, whoa. We don't need to see. Whoa, excuse me. traumatic well I hope they do are you winning son <laughs> the timing the timing that's the first level and I've never got past this bit yet so because I refuse to go further than what I've done on stream don't you touch again <laughs> requires armor. Here you go. <laughs> to battle! We shall wreck it and roll our way down to victory. How about we get up close and personal? We'll mute the game audio for a second. I give you a wonderful... Ooh, ooh. <laughs> not my best, but not my worst. Ooh. I hope that sufficed. Not my best. <laughs> but there you go. There you go. Gives you four, Good little one fun one. That's my nickname for you. Five. Sarah. <laughs> and Dev's are lending us a hand. Oh my gosh. I hate you both. 
One for the pun and the other for the... <laughs> Shut up, Sarah. I'd give more than just... <laughs> Sarah, you come in here instantly. My chat turns into de degenerates. What is this power you contain, hmm? Oh. What is it, meme dealer? What is it, my child? I don't know about this. Would you okay to leave it? Ache! Right, you listen here, you little shit. I did just spend the last half hour sorting and moving everything around for you to come up to me and say, ah. Are you hearing yourself right now? You have the guts, the audacity to come up to me after I've been nothing but decorating and telling me this place needs to look nicer. Oh, or sorry, oh, no, not exactly. square. Squares to throw. Hiya! Hey, yeah. oh, Here, no. What's that? <laughs> oh, no, you're not your <laughs> Hey, no! L2 is to run, Moppy. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> oh. <laughs> travel and make it double to protect the world from devastation to unite all peoples within our nation to denounce the evils of truth and love to extend our reach to the stars above jesse james team rocket blasts off at the speed of light surrender now or prepare to fight meow that's right <laughs> hey, my gosh uh it is by someone called N-E-N-4-B-A. There's no point in me trying to pronounce that because I would butcher it. Sig, I'm not playing League. Go to bed. It's way past your bedtime. <laughs> <laughs> Mummy Moth tells you to go to bed. <laughs> Wait, no. Everyone ignore the fact I just said Mummy Moth. Okay? <laughs> no. <laughs> oh, goodness. I don't like that at all. No. He is fucking me. Oh, 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 oh. Mm -hmm. Hi. Ah. I'm trying to be sexy. I'm gonna get cancelled. I'm gonna get cancelled. I'm going to do a completely controversial take. I gently open the door. <gasps> Emotional damage! <laughs> Beans, you bastard! Oh, I left her hanging! No! right to feel wrong about that oh no uh, <laughs> <laughs> time in it bro thank you for the Fuck hydrate same. i do indeed need to hydrate to go for my foodie woody that foodie woody so what what point have i ever said that in my life <laughs> a battle sounds like that requires armor here you go <laughs> <laughs> to battle we shall wreck it and roll our way down to victory <laughs> I don't think that's supposed to happen. I don't think that was supposed to happen. 
Oh, or oh, sorry, no, not X. Actually. Square. Squares to throw. Hi, yeah. Item. Here, no. What's that? <laughs> oh, no, you want your stuff. Hey, no. Fatality. What are we doing? <laughs> Wait, why are you crying? Why are you crying? What's going on? Why are you crying? I'm back. Why are you crying? What's going on? She's trying to. Oh, she was a PNG. <laughs> she was a PNG chiller, baby. <laughs> Good, some nice writing going on. Some nice writing. I see a little bit of riot. Fantastic. No knives, put that down. Well, that's the fun part there. Huh? Roses are red, violets are blue. You're hacking your drop them off and super lovely for all you do. That you do. <laughs> Tech, don't be like that. Hey guys, you want to hear something cool? You want to hear something cool? <laughs> oh, we have caffeine. Nom 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 nom. Oh, it's fizzy. Bleh. Oh, that's fizzy. <laughs> Welcome back. Totally didn't have knives that I passed around to chat. I mean, we do, exactly. We do have our own Moffy knives. It's okay. I do have a kitchen. I have a kitchen drawer full of knives. You're welcome to help yourself to them. Just be responsible. I'm not liable for whatever you do with your knives. Or am I? Dun dun dun! No, I'm not, because... Legalities. <laughs> kitchen gun? What do you mean kitchen gun? The Americans. Who has a kitchen gun? Sorry, don't mind me, I just gotta shoot my meat. Kitchen gun. The Americans. Charming. You don't? Have you not seen Kitchen Fun? No, I've not seen Kitchen Fun. What do you mean Kitchen Fun, Kitchen Gun? Kim, no, of course I haven't. Anyway, back to the game. Blah, 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 blah. No one sex. I'm going back to the game. You can't you can't distract me, chat. You can't distract me. Refusal. No distractions. Forbidden. Forboded. Denied. Denied. Your distraction has been denied. Ah, uh, game. Game, please. This is why you always save at every opportunity. When your PC is a potato. Game. Game, please. <laughs> Okay, well, the game crashed. <laughs> so let me just reload it. What is that? Oh, fine, you can distract me, but only for a moment. This kitchen is so hard to clean. <gasps> it's BBC, I can't play that. Kitchen gun, oh my goodness. Was this because of all of the silly bank commercials? Bang! Bang, and the dirt is gone. Yep, well, it looks American enough to me. The fact that the BBC made it shows all the truth. We know what you do. Why is she crying? Oh, damn, love. <laughs> Very good. Back a man, no worries. Thank you so much. You ran on the tailor? I do want to. I am a moth after all. How do you think I comprise this? To be fair, it's not a potato. It's it's quite good. It's 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 definitely higher than, than a potato. Would it be higher than a potato? But not like a brilliant PC. That'd be. Maybe like, I don't know, a melon? It's a melon? Uh, Fran, I don't want you open on that window. Why are you opened over there? Get over here.
literally no one asked you to open on my second monitor. Come, come this way, come back here. There you go, come back here, good lord. That's better. Thank you very much, Paddington. Bird. 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 Stop my music. There we go. Me a second, dear. It takes me a second to bloody find the motivation redeem, let alone see that you've redeemed one. I run a that's a that's a lot of things that make no sense to me. We're getting a motivation. Are you ready for your motivation? I don't think you're ready for your motivation. We're gonna get the motivation. The motivation that you have asked for is do 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 Teenagers, some of them want to tar and feather you. I mean, to be fair, that's quite accurate. I, I mean that's not exactly far from the truth, is it? <laughs> Pancakes Ghost, hello, welcome in. Thank you for the first time chat. Dance party. Nom 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 nom. I was about to say, the only kitty dance I have is the one Frosty just posted. Thank you for the kitty dance party. Mm hmm? Mm hmm? Just about to say that, but thank you. So, as I was just about to say, is at the moment there is a two minute silence that's going on uh, for all of the veterans. Or that that is not that is not the time for this. So I was going to say is if you don't mind, we're already like a minute in into the two minute silence for all the veterans on Remembrance Sunday. We're just going to take two minutes. We're just going to have a moment of silence. These do not mean this is a serious matter. Thank you.
go. For those who don't know, in England we have something called Remembrance Sunday. And on the 11th or the 11th, and it's you have a two minutes moment of silence. So basically, uh, well, it's after the last post was sounded. And the reason we have the two minute silence is obviously just to pay our respects to all of those who have fought in any any wars, any wars, doesn't matter what. Honour those who lost their lives in the First World War and all conflicts that have followed, which is why you might see the poppy around here and there. Um, England has a lot of poppy stuff when it comes to November. But at 11am every year, And we also have, um, yeah, but it, it, what it is. It's tradition. It's called being respectful and thankful for all of those who have ever lost their lives or given anything conflict in space because of war. Which I think is also very prevalent um, these days, <laughs> unfortunately, and as it always will be. No, tossing. Great. Really? All that nice and tight. Really? Time. Speed comes. The most important thing is to get your technique right. Really? Come on. There's a time and place. Yeah. You should know of all, dear. You should know of all people. You've got no excuse. <laughs> mm-hmm. Yeah, so for us, for us, it's the Remembrance Sunday, and it also happens Saturday as well. Um, there's quite a, there's quite a few dates actually. <laughs> there's quite a few dates, but the the, the main one that like uh, schools and stuff do as well. It's drilled into us basically. We do it at school as well. We're all going to the assembly hall. Oh, yay! There you go, a little bit of a insight for you there. Be squished. I'll be squished. Your grandpa served in the Navy. Oh, gosh. Yes, the 11th hour of the 11th day. The 11th month. That's how we, uh... <laughs> that's how we all remember it. It's drilled, drilled into us. But yeah, so I know that was really abrupt. I'm really sorry. I completely forgot that it's not like a known thing. And it's only when I was sitting here thinking, these guys probably have no idea why I've just suddenly told them to shut up. <laughs> I'm so sorry. I, I should have made it more clear to begin with. My apologies. That's, that was my bad as well. Mm-hmm. Yesterday and today's the official day. Oh, okay. My granny was a my great nan. She um she was a nurse and she actually met her husband. It's a really cute story actually. They they then met each other. He was jumping out of a helicopter, um, and he wasn't like an army um I think well, I can't remember what he was. Anyway, he was a parachuter regardless. I can't remember what exactly he was. But he, when he came out of the helicopter, he got uh not helicopter airplane. But I can't remember the details. Anyway, he got shot, and my great nan was the one to nurse him back to health when he was in the hospital, and that's how they met each other. And I just think that's bloody adorable. <laughs> the 11th for actual Remembrance Day, the Sunday, yeah. Yeah, Sunday is more for the religious stuff, but yeah. It's remember it's Sunday, but it's also the eleventh Saturday, so it's kind of like the the whole the both the both days. Mm -hmm. But yeah, that's that. We may go back to being what we were being, which is absolutely chaotic noodles. <laughs> veterans Day in the US. Mm -hmm. I have to say, you Americans, when it comes to veterans, oh my goodness, the respect you give them, it's phenomenal. I wish England was a bit more like that. 
Like we have some, we have respect for sure, but you guys take it to a completely another level. It's like I know often in the US and stuff, you're here like thank you for your service. I don't think I've ever heard anybody say that in the UK, just in like a general conversation. Whenever somebody says they've been in the navy or army, people generally just say, "Oh wow, gosh, you know, thank you." But we, we don't, we're not like, oh, thank you for your service. And I don't know, I feel like we should. You know what I mean? <laughs> Bizarre, isn't it? One of those things. Yeah, no, I'm quite old fashioned though. And I think things like that should have your respect. I know nowadays it's, you know, a lot of people don't respect it because of, you know, X, Y, Z. And I'm like, no, you should respect it. But again, people call me old fashioned for that, but I do think it's called being respectful. But hey ho. <laughs> Does a shift stop for That's what I mean. It's a really weird contradiction because you guys are so like, thank you for the service. But then I've heard some horror stories about how they're treated when they get back home. Hmm. Hmm. Anyway, not here to talk politics and stuff. We are here to play some more Fran Bell. And to be remembered of the general torment that torments us all, which is, you know, life. <laughs> On the plus side, I do have some marmalade toast marmalade toast now. So I can pretend I'm Paddington. Ow. <laughs> But yeah, sorry if that was completely abrupt. I completely forgot to kind of describe it to you guys. And I was just kind of like, shut up! <laughs> shut up! <laughs> I was like, oh no. They probably don't know why I'm telling them to shut up. What the stories that come from things. The stories you used to hear. Like we used to be had people come to school. Oh my god, it's crashed again. Okay, so don't have out Fran. Noted. We just have veterans come to school and tell us their stories and things. My gosh. My goodness. Right. Play. This time, don't crash when I tap out. And don't open on the wrong window either. Please, I'm asking. Oh, you open on the wrong window. Come on. You were doing so well. I can't say who followed because my game opened the wrong window, but I'll have a look in a minute. Oh, I'm really scared. Thank you so much for the follow. Welcome in. Give me two moments and I'll be with you. <gasps> Lung snake. Ah, oh, I'm really scared. Thank you so much for the follow. There you go. Okay. Oh, window portrait. Fun fact, a friend of mine started a YouTube channel where he interviews vets in the US and have them tell stories so they're comfortable. Wow! That's so cool! Oh fuck. I can't, I can't believe, believe you've done, done this. this. Frosty! Gosh darn you, what's that for? What did you do that for? How dare you? <laughs> Thank you very much, Frosty. That's very kind of you, but I can't believe you've done this. <laughs> Back into things. Does it look alright? Does it sound alright? Are we all good? Do I need to turn it up? Do I need to turn it down? Pray it hell. Give me the details. And Frosty, stop giving me cakes. Okay. Oh, I remember something funny. What's my resolution? I think my resolution was just 19. That one. Maybe not. I don't know. Same to me.
resolution looks the same to me. I'm really sucky at figuring out what looks better. Probably that one. What was happening? I thought, <laughs> Shepard, it's okay. <laughs> Don't worry about it, Shepard. It can be good to have a cozy place to stay. A very old uncle tried to blow on one of these. <laughs> he farted all of his gases out because it was so hard to blow. Frosty, again, thank you so much. It's very kind of you for the cakes. My friend has almost half a million subscribers on you. I should bloody well think so too for content like that. Incredible. Wow, piano. It sounds old. I can touch the piano and play with it, but I certainly can't play it. I wonder who the musician is out here in the middle of nowhere. I could make something out of this. It looks like a door. I know a story about a girl with red shoes. And she had a dog. I like animals, all of them. Dogs are animals. Anyway, it's just a shoe, really. I should leave it out here. It says dance, and I have no idea why. Maybe it's just a name, like my own Mr. Midnight's. Maybe a music maker who stopped loving music. I'm not going back, though. He must escape himself. I wonder if they're looking for me. What a pretty horse. Hey, bear. Here, your arm is gone. Good thing you're not bleeding. I'm kind of tired of all the red milk coming out of everyone. Who dares to leave an innocent teddy without shelter? I wonder. Mr. Midnight, are you in there? I guess not. I'll keep searching. What do we got? More forest? Nice. Red Milk was my nickname in high school. Sarah! Welcome in, darling. How are you? <laughs> oh my god, is that a giant wood louse? An ant? What? Are you what? Wow, this is a very big insect. Or is it a pig? Well, it's very odd. Well, you are a very big ant. Who's there? Excuse me, sir. Are you real? Uh, you always ask the same thing. Always. Always? What do you mean by always? Because I'm real. Where did you come from? No, I escaped the mental hospital. But please don't tell anybody. I won't tell, don't worry. But what are you doing here? Well, really bad things happen to me, sir. But now I'm looking for my cat. Cat, you say? Yes, sir. A black cat. With very big yellow eyes. Mr. Midnight. Oh, I see. I'm sorry, girl. Oh, so you haven't seen it? It happens the cat was eaten, chewed up, and swallowed. Sir, stop with the nonsense. I really need to find him. The black cat came towards me in a hurry. I'll catch it. I gave it to my beetle pig. My beetle pig is hungry. Oh, my poor beetle pig hasn't had any food in days. Blueberry time passed by and we ate them all. Stop it. Can't you see? Mr. Midnight is the only friend I have. Please tell me you're joking. Oh, little girl, don't cry. I can sing with you, like. What will I do now? You don't know how it feels to be alone. I do know, yes. I'm the last one alive. Let me help you, yes? I loved this game. I'm enjoying it so far, Sarah, that's for sure. I'm thoroughly enjoying it so far. I didn't get to have enough friends. Oh my god, same Shepherd, same! Twinsies! <laughs> How could you possibly help me? Digestion's not far, so... You no, know, maybe he's still alive inside the beetle pig. Should I do something, like make him vomit? Kill the beetle pig! He's the only friend I have left, but I need the meat. I'm curious to know if my kitty's still in there. Do it. Kill the beetle pig, and I, Antonio the Greatest, shall eat the meat. Okay, a bit fucked up, but sure, you do you. 
an owl and a hedgehog. Hedgehog, 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 hedgehog. What kind of bird are you? You look like an owl. Is that right? Your feathers are beautiful. Whoa, the terrible axe. I will be a warrior and savior of things. Um, before we kill him, it's drug time. Nom nom nom. Oh well, I could try and open it and see what's inside. I can't move the cover, it's stuck. Just my luck. Can I chop it? There you go. Make an entry. Okay, well, I'll be back in a second. Ooh. Wow, these are very rare leaves. They look a bit sad. And old. Maybe they aren't leaves. They're too white. Hello, tree. Ooh. Curiosity be damned. Curb your curiosity. No, oh, I'm like that. I'm curious. Otherwise, how will you learn things? Anyway, why won't you let me take the key? What are you? What is the right question, but why would be more appropriate? Well, I don't have time to chat, sir. I want the key, that's all. Oh, but the key isn't ours, and it's not yours for sure. It's always good to have an extra key, especially when you're up to something. I couldn't care less. The affection towards you is simply none. You're very honest, I like that. But I'm a person, Fran. Nice to meet you. Interesting. Tell us more. I have a cat. Well, had one. He is missing now, and I have to find him. Really? Yes, really. Now please, give me the key. Look, person Fran, we come from the south, flying as wolves. And one of us got curious about this key, then all of us got stuck here. And because of our long hair, we can't get loose. I see. Yes, long hair you have. Mm, long hair you have. <laughs> Can I help you? We usually get stuck on trees, but we have something to fix that. A beautiful comb to comb our hair every time we get stuck. Right, we'll do that then. But there's a problem. A filthy thief took our comb. Now we're stuck forever. If you find the thief and the comb, you'll get the key. Deal? Yes, but what does he look like? Rat. A filthy, narcissistic rat. He took the comb to make himself beautiful. He couldn't do much, so he ran away with it. Please find it and free us from this curiosity. Well, I'll try my best. I'll be here, waiting. Okay, well, they're actually quite polite. Hello? <gasps> but you're adorable. No, come back. You're adorable. Aw, rude. Fine, I'm going to eat my marmalade toast. Nyah. How are you doing there, Sarah? Munch, munch. What a joke! There's no hole inside. One of my forces united to do something unnecessary. It must mean something, or otherwise it wouldn't be here. Make an entry. Should I make it into a complete door before trying this? Can I pick up the wood? Can I pick up the wood pieces? Oh, there's a feather. Oh, a feather. Tickle, tickle. I like it. I'll keep it. I chop the wood? No? Okay. Meow. I'm doing okay. I'm at work, but I wanted to watch. Oh, Sarah! Well, thank you very much, and I hope work's doing okay. Um, I don't want to murder you, but I think I might have to. I just chopped down the tree. Sorry, I'm just eating my toast. I'm, I'm not ignoring you, I promise. I'm not gonna kill that until I'm eaten. Yum, yum, yum. Does look a little bit 
like frisk, doesn't she? It's not beans on toast, it's marmalade. Marmalade! Might be looking after a hustle celebration. <laughs> Rude. Booty, but accurate. No, it's marmalade, not jam. Marmalade is a different thank you. <laughs> you cheek. Marmalade! Why are you mamming me? It's marmalade. It's not jam, it's ma oh my god. Right. What do you mean, what is marmalade? Shut up. Yeah, orange jam, but it's marmalade. It's different. It tastes completely different. It's more tart. Hang on, I'm saving an image for you. Marmalade. See? Big difference. Marmalade. That is marmalade. It's made with like the rinds and stuff. It's much more tart. It's not jam. No, this is jam. I'm just gonna get a jam picture. Bro, why are these pictures so bad? Why is it not a good picture of jam? Hang on. I just want a nice picture of jam. There you go, okay. No, don't save it as a web MP. Weirdo. Okay. Jam. Marmalade. Jam. Marmalade. See? Big difference. You can see the consistency is different for a start. I mean, you can get thicker jam, don't get me wrong, but... It's not the same thing! So jam's obviously like, like made from like fruit, veg, whatever. Whereas marmalade is purely citrus. Like, it's purely just the peel. Like, you don't use the whole thing. Like, jam, you smoosh everything together, right? And you make it into like a pulp. Whereas marmalade... It's just the peel and like a couple of other bits and bobs. But you don't use the whole fruit and it's different. It's citrusy. It tastes different. Look, I'll even Google it. There you go. Marmalade. A sweet food made from citrus fruit, especially bitter oranges and sugar boiled to make a thick consistency, usually eaten and spread on toast. Thank you. Jam, on the other hand, by Google Jam. Well, well, well. What <laughs> have we here? <laughs> Mr. Sagipus, oh, I'm really scared. Thank you for the follow. Welcome to the jam marmalade debate. Jam refers to a product made of whole fruit cut into pieces or crushed, then heated with water and sugar until it reaches jellying or setting point. Big difference. <laughs> kind of. Basically, one's citrus, one's not, but marmalade is a lot more tart and is preferable for. Sour Brits like myself. But thank you, Psychipus. Welcome in. See, Dream Demon's got it right. See, Dream Demon did the Google. It tastes a lot less fake. Oh, it depends on the marmalade, to be fair, darling. Jamalade. I thought marmalade was like what? 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 The? And then you're probably thinking about pickle. 
<laughs> we're not having a toast debate. No, we're playing. <laughs> Going by some. Oh, I deleted myself. Whoops. Marmalade have one properly. Marmalade's a lot thicker as well, usually. Usually. Anyway, <laughs> if the game's crushed, I'm going to blame you. You made me tab out to show you jam and marmalade. Nope, we're good. <laughs> okay. It's probably just made of a different kind of sugar. I've never heard of black marmalade. Hang on. Now you're making me Google that. God damn it. Black marmalade. Oh, it's just, it's just black currant jam, basically. Oh, no, dark sugar and treacle. There you go. It's called a moody marmalade. <laughs> um, okay, well, I don't want to kill you, but sorry, fam. Yeah, you've run away. And a boy. Oh, sir. Oh, he's fallen asleep. I guess he's very old, like 30 years. I won't disturb him. Rest well, sir, aunt. Oh, you pig. Did you eat my cat? Mr. Midnight, just wait. Don't die. I'll get you out of there real soon. He just runs back and forth. I'm gonna do it again. Run for me, piggy. Imagine we just keep doing it. Or maybe do we go into drug mode? Drug mode! run that way these guys near the well or if he runs here
Mike is muted dear Mathy. Sorry, I was having a bit of a coughing fit. <laughs> Thank you though, Frosty. I'm all good now, I've hydrated. <laughs> I'm back. Thank you though, Frosty. Thank you, both of you. <laughs> I appreciate the concern though. I appreciate the concern. <laughs> Next time I will try to announce before I choke everywhere. <laughs> huh? <laughs> fungi, Fungi, hello! Well, you're progressing through the game, so I wanted to make sure- Oh, sorry, I just- I, I was this just trying to breathe. Oh um, my. You should, should be concerned. concerned. Oh, for God's sake. Morph, I need a character name for D&D. Give me a girl name for a human marine. Um, you and Marine. Hmm. Seychelles. <laughs> I don't know. I'm bad with names. I just go into random name generators and hope for the best. Crisis averted. Mm -hmm. All good. All right. It seems to open, but it's very stuck. The power of destruction will take it down. Okay. Power of destruction! Oh, a door handle to handle big problems. I'll keep it. Okay. On mine. The perfect. The handle won't stay on. Hello? Is anybody home? It looks like a lamp is lit. Lamp! Lamp! Human Marine, Marie? That's not bad, Frosty. That's not bad. Anyone texting me, Morthy, it should be concerned. <laughs> Feel free to use it as your text tone if you want. My goodness. <gasps> Thank you, Sarah. Thank you. Have a wonderful day at work. I will I will enjoy frowning the bow. The bow. Bow! It's not bow, it's bow! Hopefully. <laughs> Take care. It's available where? I don't know, it's just on Blurb. Is it on Blurb or is it on Tangia? I think it's Tangia, the one that's used. If not, I can just be quiet for a minute and you can take it. <laughs> you can play it and then I... <laughs> they just record it. Oh dear, I don't know. This, this is concerning. concerning. Oh my. You, you shouldn't be concerned. concerned. Blurp. There you go, then. Hmm. Tea time, sir. I shouldn't take other stuff, but I want super glue for the attachment. There we go, then. Combine. Combine. Made a door. I wonder where it would take me. The queen of meat. Oh, no! That's awful! <laughs> oh, no! And porn. There's water in the sink. Maybe it's her ant likes to drown tiny monsters in there. Or maybe he's just a very clean ant. Um, what's this? Underpants? They smell good. Grandpa soap. So that means the big ant was naked? Huh? Draw me like one of your French ants. <laughs> That's odd. I thought ants never cooked their meals. But then again, I'm all confused, and he isn't an ant. He's a man that looks like an ant. But no, he must be an ant. The cute little lamp. Meat. Even if I wanted to take the meat, I can't reach it. The meat won't come down. I'll have to go up. Think. Stinky and raw. Meat for the eaters. They already got one piece. I won't touch it again. I wish I could sleep with my kitty on this bed. But I think there'll be a lot of creatures under the blanket. 
like bugs and things that would like to eat my brain. Oh my gosh, what? <laughs> Sir, you look so angry. Your family is very nice, Sir Pinecone. But you're a very scary guy. Wow, you're very rare. Lady Pinecone, what are you cooking? Don't be scared, I just want some berries. The blueberries. Ow, that hurt. Stop it, you bad pinecone. I need those blueberries. Hmm. I have to trick him, but how? <gasps> Baby pinecone. Oh, that's so sweet. Don't fall off the chair. Be careful. Here comes your mummy to the rescue. I just noticed her, like... Uh, would you like some meat? No? Okay. Well, let's go. Ooh. Well, well, well. What have we here? Fun guy, fun guy. Oh, really scared. Thank you for the follow and welcome. I hope you're enjoying yourself. This is, this is delightful. You tiny creatures, please don't eat me. Get off the bag, I want it. Did you eat this man's flesh? That's repulsive. Ah, well, now we know what to do with the meat. Yum, 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 yum. It worked. Now the bag is mine. The bag has an anti-bug sign. Hmm. The bag is open. Oh, a rat trap. And some sort of card. <laughs> um, the text is almost gone. I can see the number just about. John Flummet. It says exterminator. Poor tiny monsters. That bug looks seriously mad. My goodness. The pest exterminator. And he is dead. Sir, you have a ton of ants on you. I think they're trying to steal your bag. Poor Fran. <gasps> so precious. I will name the bug John. <laughs> wow. This is a very big anthill. It's scary to think how many millions of ants must be inside. I'm not sure if I want to go inside then. Say ya, say ya, say ya, say ya, say ya! Hello, how are you? Welcome in. Oh no! Look, friend! I'm in danger! <laughs> Find me alive. Find me dead. Find me someday in a golden cage. Okay. Casual guy having a nice little wander in the background. What else do we have? We can go to the door. We can go to the um, well now, I think. Nice. Okay, let's save quickly. How are you doing, Saya? I hope you're doing well. Greetings, DC! Thank Watching you, Edgar get drilled was very good. Ah. Oh. Thank you, as always, and all the same back to you, DC. Hope you are doing well. Good vibes and head pads to you as well, my sweet. Doing fine as always. I'm doing well, thank you. I'm doing well. Just had some foods. I've got a cup of tea next to me and an energy drink, so we're thriving. We're playing a fantastic game, and chat is keeping me the most wonderful company, so we're doing perfectly well. Oh no, you're going to make me try and read that in an accent, aren't you? Greetings, you wee woolly old crazies and otherwise mentally insane lunatics. How your bloody willies doing? <laughs> you can't say I didn't try. You can't say I didn't try. Hello, Pittsburgh Radio. How are you? Oh, 
open. Why are you closed? I made you. I command you to open. I am your creator. And I guess the door won't listen. And I have to get the key. Where's the key? Oh, it's got to be... Oh, the keys with the... Gosh, yeah. Okay. Now we have a giant rat trap. Can I just, like, place this wherever? Um... <gasps> welcome in, welcome in, Raiders of Wrecker Rockhouse! My, my. What a fantastic name. How are you doing? Let me give you your shout out. How are you doing, my lovely? Thank you so much for the raid! It's a pleasure to have you here. I am the Morbid Moth, a sassy British moth YouTuber who sucks at games and life. We are playing some Fran Bow. I've never played it before, but we're getting there. I'm thoroughly enjoying it, and chat is keeping me wonderful company, as I was just saying. <laughs> but what were you up to? Please tell me. How did your stream go? Were you uh, doing much mischief and mayhem? Okay, can I use the trap on you? Ah! And now if I try and touch his son, or touch him... He's go oh, this is gonna be brutal! Okay, the child didn't fall then. Good, good, good. So... Okay, that's not too bad. I got you. Sorry, sir, but I really need those berries. <laughs> ah, now the mum's hitting me. Bad mama! There we go. Distract! Drink! I got them. They smell delicious. Doing Kingdom Hearts proud mode. Bloody hell. I can barely play it on normal. We beat... Oh my gosh. Well done for a start. That is incredible. No. They locked the door. Now can you blame them? It's the lady again. No, come back. A Kingdom Hearts fan. <laughs> <laughs> Frosty's happy. I love Kingdom Hearts, but I'm so awful at it. Okay. Um. Here you go. There you pig. I don't want a kid! Oh! <gasps> it's the rat! What? You're not my cat. Oh, miss, you saved me from misery. Good for you, but I was hoping to find somebody else. I assume you're feeling disappointed. Who were you looking for? My cat. My lovely cat, Mr. Midnight. Oh, Miss Lady, I'm not very fond of cats, you know. A black one with very big yellow eyes was trying to catch me. <gasps> oh, really? You seem to get in trouble often. Wait, maybe he's my cat. Oh, my lady, well, if he is, he is the one in trouble now. Tell me where you last saw him, please. I can show you. Follow me. It's not far from here. I'm sorry, Mr. Beetle Pig. I wish I hadn't killed you. But you're dead now, so you can't hear me. I really wanted to find Mr. Midnight. Beetle Pig is dead now, sir. Thank you. Now we eat. I can't. Just so you know, there was no cat inside the Beetle Pig, but a rat. A rat? Oh, I'm sorry. My eyes are very old, you see. I also have heart problems. And a bad back. I also suffer from narcolepsy, and sometimes I don't. And he's gone again. <laughs> Kingdom Hearts is the greatest game series to be. Mm -hmm -hmm. Oh, I, I've, yeah, I've, been play I've played Kingdom Hearts since I was a child, but the thing is, I've never completed them because I I'm not very really good at them at all, but I do en thoroughly enjoy them. Big, big fan here as well. I need to try and finish them one day. Maybe. <laughs> but I'm glad you had a fun time. Don't forget to stretch, hydrate, and grab some food. Do all of the post-stream stuff you need to do. I'm proud of running all of the games. Bloody hell. Good, good on you. I, <laughs> I'm not, not incredibly skilled enough, unfortunately. Here we are. 
Somebody took him, miss. They just disappeared. Oh my goodness, could you be more specific? I wish I could. It looks like the Earth swallowed them. If there's anything else I can do, just let me know. I'll be around. Uh, would you like the ticket? No? Okay, well, fun time. <gasps> Mr. Rat, no! We need you to play the Kingdom Hearts. I mean, I'm down. I'm completely down. I can help guide you. It's more the combat I suck at. Like, I'm just very bad at getting all the combos and knowing what skills to have equipped. <laughs> I got quite close to finishing the second one, though. I got very close. Rat, who did this to you? Was it my kitty? Okay. Well... The ground swallowed. We've got the exterminator ticket, but I'm not quite sure why. Well, well, well. <gasps> what have we here? A sweet tart. Oh, I'm really scared. Thank you so much for the follow and welcome in. How are you doing? The ground swallowed him. Who tried to talk again? Excuse me. Did you steal a hair comb? With the hair comb? The shiny, beautiful hair comb. Can I have it, please? All right, then, but can you comb my hair first? Yes, I can comb your hair. Oh! That is so cute! Look at that! That's so cute! Hello, sweetheart! Thank you so much for the first time chat and welcome! I had to take a break from my level 1 only crit- Oh, Frost is so bad. Tried to go for Kingdom Hearts. It's only level 1. No, how do you- How would you- How was that even possible? Oh. Thank you, my lady. You're very kind. Well, of course, you're adorable rat. Rats are adorable. Yeah, I agree with you, Eliminator. Completely agree. <laughs> oh, I went too far. Nom. There we go. Bash, bash, bash. No, do do I just talk to them? There we go. Here's your beautiful comb, misters. That's so cute. I don't care what you say. That is cute. That is wholesome. Oh, Fran, the person. You finally did it. Hope the key opens the door you want to open. Now we fly south at last. Goodbye. So oh, beautiful. Goodbye, shiny misters. And have a nice trip. Oh. Now we've got the key. Fantastic. You're halfway through. Halfway through, Frosty! Good lord. Hey! It worked! What a curious little door. I wonder where it'll lead me. Mr. Midnight, are you here? Ugh. In the Pound's Labyrinth. Chapter 2 Double Personality. Dark stuff can still be wholesome? Oh, 110%. Oh my gosh, watch. <gasps> Goodness, where am I? What's this? A hat? Mr. Midnight, oh no, your head! Kitty. Wait a second. This isn't my kitty. What a weird hat. Anyways, I have to find Kitty. I hope you're here somewhere. Oh, bloody hells. 
Welcome home, beautiful kitten. We hope you'll like your new bed. Be nice and eat your food. Love, Clara and Mia. You won't lay down in that thing. I should try to get out of here instead. With my kitty, of course, not by myself. It's fun to see what people have in their homes. Meow. Meow. My hugs and chats say, how horrifyingly wholesome of you. Oh, I love that. How horrifyingly wholesome of you. <laughs> oh, that is fantastic. Horrifyingly wholesome. Huh? Huh? Again, he has an Instagram account, you know that cat. You can go follow him. He's fantastic. <laughs> Nothing of interest. Are those eyes? Oof. Maybe they like to see things, so they need more eyes. And I have my pills. They make me see a lot of weird things. Hmm, a head. From a human, I guess. Skulls always look so happy. <sighs> Maybe they haven't realized they're dead yet. I close the window so the cold stays out. I open the window so the cold comes in. A cooker for cooking. My mummy told me how to use this. I don't like to light matches though. I always feel like it could burn my entire face. I don't really need to hydrate to go with my foodie meal. When foodie woody meal. With a lemon and honey. Okay, she likes tea with lemon and honey. What's next? Ooh, that's a pretty knife. Oh, a sharpie shiny knife. You might be useful. Spatula sounds like Dracula, but in a spa. Ah, cookies in all flavors and colors. It is from fuck's sake. Honey bear, you taste fabulous. Flower makes me sneeze, but that's a funny feeling. Thank you for the hydrate. Actually, I do need drinks. Your posture is regrettable. I'm posture Concentrate chair. on sitting I'm straight. straight. Sorry, I had a big stretch there. I hope you have a stretch as well. Have a hydrate and a posture check. Unshrimp yourselves, chat. <laughs> and unclench your jaw. Yes, you know what I'm on about. <sighs> nom, 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 nom. Thank you. I always do. King Leo's baking soda. This always made the biggest cupcakes. A pine cone. I don't dare touch it. it. Might attack me. Dry my little hands. I don't have any soup, so I don't need a spoon. I would to keep the chimney warm. Poor trees. I wonder if they scream all the time while they're burning. I've wondered the same thing too. Mr. Midnight. Those girls, they they took my kitty. I don't like to be selfish, but that is my kitten. I like that blue dress, though. Okay. This doesn't bring me any good memories. Ooh. The bag smells funny. I'm not going to touch it. <gasps> Beans! I don't like beans that much. Salt! A very good ingredient. <laughs> what are you applauding for? What are you applauding for? <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> Ugh. Odd little thing. It looks like a seed. I wonder who Mush is, because he owns all of the mushrooms. A squirrel's body parts? I don't even want to know. But he likes to play with olives. I guess he thinks they're insects. Why not clap? Well, <laughs> because I don't deserve a clap, I don't know. If there's garlic, there are no vampires. Pepper, always good for seasoning the soup. I'm guessing we're going to be making soup in a minute. I won't take somebody else's food. Well, well, Not all of it, well. anyway. What have we here? 
A bat in the attics? Oh, I'm really scared. Thank you for the follow and welcome in. I hope you enjoy your stay at the Morbid Mansion. Pleasure to have you. The pretty can. Water. The window's locked. Great. I have matches to light up the darkness, or just for fun. They don't smell. They must be plastic flowers. Can I pick up the stool? I won't sit down. Okay. Okay, don't be angry. This looks like a plant. So we're dancing Teddy. It doesn't have shoes, but it does have a tie, and that makes Teddy happy. Okay, I like this wallpaper. This is lovely wallpaper. Oh, this is beautiful. Look at this. <gasps> oh, this is delightful. I have no idea how I got here, but I love the game and you're a moth, so I've got to follow. Oh, Badge, thank you so much. <laughs> I'm not quite sure how you got here, Eva, but thank you so much. I hope you enjoy sticking around. So much. It's a house. Tiny house in the middle of nowhere. A walk of the beach wouldn't take too long. It looks like somebody's lived there. They have a chimney. Oh, naked mermaid. That was a mysterious woman. I like the blue rose. I never saw a rose in the ocean. Maybe it's an old story. Maybe the moon gave her the rose because he loves her. Their faces look familiar. But I'm not sure. Could it be? They definitely look like one of the girls from the asylums. A vase to put some flowers in. It has ashes inside. Uh, combine. <laughs> Is that a flying pig? I wonder if any friendly animal would like to fly with us. That would be a new experience. Not that I don't have any. Now I understand what the deer wanted back in the hospital. It didn't want to get its head fixed. It wanted its head on the wall. Silly me. Imagine knowing where you are. I know, right? <laughs> I may have come in on a raid while I was playing Apex for hours. Oh no! You, you got in the rabbit hole, did you? Too deep and you couldn't come out. Do you love the night before Christmas sound alert? Thank you! I thought whatever first rather what better else to have? Hmm. Cozy and warm. I could burn things here that I don't need. But you never know when you'll need some things. Why would a line to be burned? Ooh, okay. Something dramatic happened there. Um let's look at the tea then. This isn't my cup. A sugar in all different colours. Delicious and beautiful. Caramel sauce all over it. And that cake looks absolutely yummy. Sweet candy. Chocolate cake, my favourite. Should I... Maybe just a little. Mm, delicious. Oh. I could eat the whole thing. I'm so hungry. Nobody would notice if one cupcake's missing. Yum, yum, yum. The teapot has no tea in it at all. That's sacrilege. Sacrilege! All the way down the rabbit hole, right into the moth's lamp. Mm -hmm. I would know. I'm a rabbit. <gasps> Look at that then. That's, that's adorable. Stop being adorable, chat. Stop it. Burning candles. Okay, bye bye. Many tiny paintings. And there's a cat. When I grow up, I'll have lots of cat paintings on my walls. And other things too, but I'm not grown up yet. Oh my goodness, the smell! Poor oh girl. Who could have done this and why? I need to be careful and protect myself and my kitty. It's 
Chance. <gasps> he was a famous jazz musician. The ant was a fame. Oh, fantastic. Wait a minute. Is that the big ant from the woods? Could it be him, but a bit younger? Chance. I think I saw the name earlier. Wait a minute. We're a record player. I wonder if it works. Don't play it yet. There are many books and things on the shelf. So many that it makes me dizzy. I'll just leave them there. Owls and cats are a bit alike. Both are curious, and they both like to kill mice. And both are good companions of witches. Oh, thank you! Thank you for the head pads! I guess I could write something, but there isn't any paper. And a good writer has to know what to write about first. Wow. I can't see anything but water. Where is this place? I hope Mr. Midnight knows how to get out of here. Okay. Um, let's see. Oh, there, it works. Maybe I should keep it down. Yeah, just keep that playing. I'm sure nothing can go wrong. I'm sure nothing will go wrong. Okay, well... That's that explored. But what if? Nom nom nom. Ooh. Okay. Hello, little baby. What are you doing here? Nobody loves you, but you're so pretty. I like you. At least you're on the wall like a picture, so everyone can see you. Oh, I see you're very comfortable there, little baby. Why are there so many babies? Why are there so many babies down a well? That's not okay. The insides look like a pomegranate. It kind of does, doesn't it? <laughs> did your mummy drop you? I bet she did it because she was sick. It's not your fault. Oh, I see. You're very comfortable. You seem fresh. Are you still alive? You're a clever little baby. You took your placenta with you. The placenta is like the jet pack of blood nutrients. You're not wrong. You're not wrong. Ooh, where are we going? Where are we going? Can't get there to here. I need a bridge. Oh, I haven't got a bridge, I'm afraid. Oh, we're over here now. Okay. Nom, nom, nom. Okay, so this whole bottom bit just seems to be a well. What about the next room? Okay, this is just the well as well. Oh, what you're booking? Oh, what you're booking? Oh, what you're booking? Lucky dog. Please and shall go to bed now. It's 7am. Oh my goodness. Yes, please do get some rest. If it's 7am for you. Good lord. Please get some good rest. But I shall be back. Oh, well, thank you. And it was lovely meeting you as well. Thank you so much. And for the kind words. Take care. Get some good rest. Okay, so we have a broom now. A monster who likes goats. The goat looks angry. I guess he's ticklish. Or annoyed. The drawer opened. Let's see what's inside. Black candles to light up the darkness. Okay. The drawer is empty. The sisters, they look alike. A red rose in a painting. Ah. Huh. Pink and blue. Complete opposites. 
Okie dokie. It's only 4am for me. Oh, Rekka, you just don't try and get some sleep though. 4am is a perfectly reasonable time to sleep. It's currently 12 in the afternoon for me. Hmm. The perfume smells like teenagers. Nice stuff. Very girly. I guess I'll be very girly when I grow up. Jesus, to pick things up that my little hands can't. A mirror. But why isn't my reflection there? Hello? Huh? This mirror isn't doing its job. It does have a little keyhole. Maybe it's just decor. Ugh! It's like that monster. And so much blood. I guess I'm not the only one who can see him then. Is he holding a head? I have to be careful. White candles everywhere. This looks like a very old painting. my usual colors. How useful it was my Halloween outfit, but thank you so much. Popping by, how are you? Is ramen smart for breakfast? I, th I would say no, personally, but then again, it depends what else you've eaten and if you've got anything else to eat. So, you know. <laughs> as long as you're eating, I guess? Still. Wonder. I'll lay down and sleep tight when I get back home. Aunt Grace has for sure put on some fresh sheets. I love the feeling of my sleepy head on the clean pillow. Oh, it feels so good, doesn't it? I wonder what the deal is with the doll's head and roses. I guess I'll figure it out someday. Dolls are like hollow humans. Oh, that's a good point. Ugh, these toys are ugly. I hope they didn't hear me. I don't want them trying to catch me and kill me. Hello, doll. Who caught you? I hope that never happens to me. I guess it doesn't need to happen if I'm clever enough. Okay, munchy time. Nom nom nom. Oh. We just fall back down the well again. Okay. Could we balance on the broom, perhaps? Ah! Add on to your book. It's a bit of a stretch. <gasps> it worked! I, I very much doubted that. Oh, it's about to say. Bad piece of room. Bad. Bad. Hopper is talkative because there's someone outside the window, so they're freaking out. <laughs> hmm. Where's my broken broom gone then? What is the point of me breaking that broom? Can I make a cake? Can I set them on fire? Hmm. Um. And mine. The salt and pepper. <laughs> Can I use this on the sink? Rinse it out? No? There's somewhere I've not been yet. Oh yeah, that's the other staircase, wasn't there? Though. The stairs end in a wall. Maybe that was the door and I made it disappeared. I have to find another way out. Oh, okay. Uh, then what if I do that over here? Hmm. Okay, 
then. How do I pick these things out? Use. Undead pig, undead pig. Oh no. No. The exterminator ticket. <gasps> Slim, thank you. Thank you for the look. Take care. Rekka, that is exactly what he's, he's saying. Hmm. Okay, so we've got the baking soda, the knife. Do not make me take that off. Good, I was about to say. <laughs> I like, do not make me take that off. Miss something. I, what if I'm not. There's a candle there. Can I touch the candle? No. Is there anything upstairs that I missed? Oh, hello. Oh, there's a chain. A ladder. Perhaps Mr. Midnight's up there. And then the dead girl was in here. Where's she gone? Ah, I don't know. I just heard really good news. That's great to hear, Phoenix. I'm glad. I love pretending what doggos are saying. I mean, to be fair, you're not far off of what they are probably saying. Ooh. Nice. Oh, there's a dead rat. That's not very nice. Okay, there's a lot going on up here. Mr. Rat, it's time to get up. I met another rat a while ago. Mr. Rat, are you tired, sir? Hmm. A bunch of records. I'm not in the mood for happy music, I guess. Toys in the attic always carry sadness within them. It's very understandable. I wouldn't like it to be abandoned in the attic. Hmm. A lot of tiny stuff. Is that an angel's head? You could find weird stuff in an attic. That's a big umbrella. A dusty mirror and some other things. I won't put my hands inside the box. There must be like a thousand spiders in there. I like my own dress, but those are pretty too. I guess I don't need them. I hope nobody's behind that mask. I keep sneaking back, don't tell my boss, Sarah! Don't get yourself in trouble, dear. The blue macaws were brought back from extinction. What? Are they really? That's fantastic news if that's true. <laughs> Sarah, don't get in trouble. I'm not worth it. <laughs> I'm really not worth it. What a pretty doll. I like the hairstyle. Why are you sitting here? There's lots of dolls to play with. But I wouldn't play with any of them. They look scary. Just one hat. Ooh. Oh, let's see this. The sisters. But if they're the sisters, why do they look so old? They had the same jacket that I had in the hospital. A scorpion! The scorpions make me nervous. They walk with their butt in the air, ready to stab you. Maybe it's a zodiac thing. I'm a Sagittarius. And I'm an Aquarius. <laughs> I miss you. I miss you too, Sarah. But don't lose your job just because you're trying to watch me. That's bad. You can always tell what cats are saying. It's usually either feed me peasant or pay it. That's mm, true that. Don't maybe to get Ada hit, don't you do it? Oh, Foxy, oh no. I wish I could take you out of here. What's their problem? Oh, Foxy Fox. I hope someday I find a fox that isn't dead so I can talk to it. Ooh. Hello. Oh, oh, oh 
Oh, good lord, I'm sorry. What I did was say hello. Oh, hello, little babies. You sewed you two together. It looks like it hurts. Don't cry, all right? You should smile and be nice. It's time to sleep. Oh, I didn't really ask you to cry. Weirdos. How dare they? That's so rude. All I did was look at them. Butt stab. <laughs> to be fair, butt stabbing does sound like something Sarah would do. <laughs> Just chilling now. Hello. Oh no, never mind. I'm sorry. These shoes are too big for me. Bunny doll, are you waiting for Easter? Do you lay eggs or do you steal them from a chicken? And how do the eggs become chocolate? <laughs> it means exactly what you're thinking, Sarah. Probably. I don't know. Mr. Midnight, are you here? Kitty? Mr. Midnight, don't be scared. I'm here for you. Ren? I is that really you? Oh dear. Finally. It's, it's me. Come closer, please. Let me see you. Oof. Oh, Fran. I'm so happy to see you. I missed you very much. I had dreams about you. And here you are. Thank goodness for not giving up. I love you, my friend. I love you too, Mr. Midnight. And I really missed you. Oh, dear friend. How did you find this place? After those people took you away into the woods, I tried to follow them, but after a while I got lost. My senses were too weak to track you. I tried to catch some food to recover, but something happened. Somebody took me and put me in the cage. My dear... I'll open this cage. We need to get to Aunt Grace. And very tired. I wish this was all a bad dream. Going to be fine. We just have to get out of here. Ran, can I ask you something? Uh, sure, Miss Midnight. What is it? You feel my presence in your dreams. Yes, I did. You told me to take the medicine and find you. What medicine, Fran? It wasn't really me talking to you. I think something was helping us get together. Every time I had dreams about you, I felt the presence of something else. Really? What kind of presence? Hmm, one I felt. It wasn't a human, but it was really peaceful and kind. Well, whatever it is is good, and it brought us together. Bran, did you hear that? Did you? I'll see what it is. I'll try and find the key to free you, alright? I love you. Oh, You're so cute! Oh, Fran, please. Get out of this cage. Find the key. Oh, oh, oh. Can I stab the babies? We gotta save the baby. <gasps> it's the sisters! Oh, you scared me. Thought nobody was living here. There you are. We were waiting for you. Where's your head? Waiting for me? But why? It's you, the precious being from the other world, who would ever believe us. Oh, the way she fixed up the teacup for her. I'm sorry, but. I can't make sense of what you're saying. Fran Bo. Oh, well, <gasps> what have we here? Rika Mi VT. Oh, I'm really scared. Thank you for the follow and welcome in. I hope you enjoy your time at the Morbid Mansion. Uh, Sarah, I know nothing about this game. I am learning about it all for the first time. Fran Bo. That's your name, right? And your mum and dad died tragically. It was very brutal. Right? And now you really want to know who killed them. Right? Slow down. How do you know all this? We simply have to know. 
We're part of this world. But don't be sad. Bad things happen to all of us, all the time. Well, I wish nothing bad had happened to me. I feel completely lost. Don't wish for things that can't be done. Find solutions and answers. I should do that, but Mummy and Daddy will never come back. Drink some tea and eat some cake. It will make you feel better. As a Brit, I can 100% say that this statement right here is true. Drink some tea and eat some cake. That is the answer to all of your problems, trust me. <laughs> it is how we've survived as a country. I took Moff advice and broke out the wheaty cereal. Nom 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 nom. I love the voice, hope you're having fun. Oh, absolutely I am. And Rikami, thank you so much for hopping by. It's an absolute delight to have you here. I hope you're having a fantastic day or evening yourself, and thank you for the compliments. Well, I've just popped you a follow as well. I think, oh my gosh, you look absolutely fabulous. Oh my gosh, you look amazing. Look at you. Oh, I'm getting all flustered now. <laughs> Chad, why are you all full of what such wonderful people? I'm too nice. Oh, shut, shut it. You're the nice ones. You're the one that's coming in here and giving me compliments. As I, ha I have a rule here. If you compliment me, it means you have to compliment yourself. So, you know, sucks to suck. <laughs> Why are you so adorable? I don't know, ask yourself that, because you're more adorable than I could ever be, Phoenix. Hey, yo. <laughs> uh, well, guess what? Wrong house. Guess what? Guess what, hun? I, too, can play that card. Bosh. Get Uno reversed. Time to get ready for breakfast. I'll be back. Of course, Frosty. Have a wonderful breakfast. Moffy adorable. Oh, stop it. Stop it. I'm ignoring you. I'm ignoring you now. I'm going back to the game. <laughs> you can't compliment me if I don't see it. <laughs> Thank you. But I really need to know. Who told you these things about me? Are you scared, little Fran? Of course not. I'm just curious, that's all. Mostly, I'm confused. You haven't asked about your cat yet. Mr. Midnight. That's very odd for a girl who loves a cat more than anything in the world. This is more abuse. <laughs> Shut up. Yet he looks so calm after finding him in a cage. Hungry. Scared. Shouldn't it be us trembling in fear of you? I love him, and that's why I'm here. I didn't mean to be rude to you. Do you want him back? Yes, please. I really want to have him back. He's my best friend. Before we set him free, tell us how you came here. Well, it's a long story. I escaped from a place, a very ugly place. They opened the heads of children to find out what's wrong with them. Bill told me a secret and I was clever enough to find the way out. And then I came to the woods and met a giant ant. Speaking of ants, that ant is back on my monitor. Come here, little one. Get off of my screen. I don't want to squish you. I will put you on my plant if that would make you happy. If not, I will just flick you back down onto the floor. No? Okay, well, on the floor you go then. Chew. Tell your ant brethren not to be... <laughs> Get off my screen! What are you doing? <laughs> it's exactly the same ant as earlier as well. That's all my heart emotes. Well, Rekka, they are wonderful. Thank you for sharing them. I love seeing... I don't know if it's, it's no, like a thing or not, but I love seeing other people's emotes. Like, just to see the diverse amount of art out there. I love it. How can you not like the creativity that exists? It, it's beautiful! Look, see? Exactly! That everyone has like their own little emotes and like little artists and oh, I love them! I love them! How could 
you not? How can you not be fascinated by like just the world, maybe, like the vast world of art out there? Exactly. Look at that. I need to get a mothy heart emoji. Moffy heart emoji. I'll write it down. I've got my bit of paper. You know what that means. Where's my pen? My pen. Ah. Right, there's my pen. I've got my pen. You know what that means? That means I'm writing it down. Heart. Be in mood. There you go. Good lord. You guys are giving me a long list of things to do. Thank you. <laughs> it's nice to be occupied. Mm -hmm. Exactly. I mean, look at the diversity of all the arts here. The different styles and the colours. Arch is fantastic. I, w I wish I could arch. <laughs> the best I could do is perhaps a bit of voice acting and singing. Maybe writing at a push, but... Look at that. Look at those. Fantastic. But anyway, I came into the woods and I met a giant ant. <laughs> As you do. Your beautiful morph, says you, Shepherd. Oh, sweet, that's adorable! Innocent, oh, they're so cute. Thank you for sharing them. I killed a bug and it was terrible. And then I met a rat who wanted to get his head on. And then I made a door and the door took me here. But when I entered the door, something happened. I don't remember anything else. Oh, and I saw a real pinecone family. That was before I came here. They live in Mr. Antonio's house. They like berries. What were we thinking about? Probably not a lot, knowing me. <laughs> Big head, but brain empty. Oh, and I saw flying insects that got stuck in the trees because they have long hair. Um, that was also in the woods, and now here I am, looking for Mr. Midnight. That was some adventure. How old are you, Fran? I'm ten years old, but I'm going to turn eleven soon. And you? We're sixteen years old, much older than you, so you have to obey us. Well, I don't want to obey you. You can't tell me what to do. You haven't even asked our names. That's not polite. And you shouldn't wander around someone's house without permission. Are you stupid? A stupid little girl with no family at all. I'm not stupid, and I do have a family. I have Aunt Grace and my kitten. Are you crying? Because if you are, you'll get in trouble. If you don't do exactly as we say, you and your cat will die. Do you understand? No. You don't scare me. Free my cat now. You idiot. You ask for it. If you don't do what we ask, bad things will happen to your cat. We will force you to kill him with your own hands. Oh, please. I'll do whatever you ask. Good. Now listen to us carefully. We need you to perform a magic spell on us. Do you like magic? <gasps> yes. Annie also did magic, but she had no idea how to actually do it. Anyway, this magic is very powerful and dangerous. Here's the recipe. Be careful and precise, otherwise terrible things can happen. Summon the old lost body. Lost in darkness, lost in tears. Your body becomes a lie through the hand of one angel that decides to bring you sorrow. You will need the heart of a frog, the head of a young virgin, the hair and blood from a black cat, a pentagram made of ashes, and the burnt body of a frog. This must be cooked all together inside a pot or cauldron with plenty of water. When you are about to drink the potion, repeat these words. Nam nam nabur kagrnesai. Ormanai, Igbontari, Brure, Eshiborn, Mor, Taxnai, Maruka, Librune, Frian, Frian. Hmm. 
Hmm. I think. Or oh, something along those translations. And why can't you do it yourselves? We can't do it. It would kill us. You see, we weren't like this before. We used to be two different people in two different bodies. You mean you weren't born like this? One night, a long time ago, something appeared before us. Mothy reading from the Mothronomicon. <laughs> Stop that, the Mothronomicon. <laughs> Why do I love the sound of that, though? That's not... <laughs> the Mothronomicon, honestly. Behave yourself. <laughs> we thought it was an angel, but it wasn't. He decided we should spend eternity together. He cursed us to be like this. We never understood why. We have a spell to bring him back, but we'll do that later when we're no longer attached to each other. And show him that he's powerless, that he will regret it. That sounds terrible. I'll try my best to help you. We're going to gather some things you'll need for the ritual. And because you've been a very nutty girl, you would even be able to talk to your cat. You'll have to wait till we come back. Please let me talk to him. Let me give him some food. No, you can't. And Fran, do you see this key? Can you imagine what can be opened with it? Can you, you silly, silly girl? <laughs> All right, bitches. How oh, dare they? What do we need then? Rock, virgin, pentagram, body. Like, well, where did they bugger off to? Oh, they just vanished, did they? That's nice of them. There they. Okay, um... I don't know, is there anything different? There must be, surely. Oh my lord, hello there! It's him again. But I haven't taken my pills. Well, he opened the window. Thank you, but who is he? I don't know, but he is fantastic. Oh, look at our drawing! And the blueberries! <gasps> I didn't mean to do that. I meant to look at the window. Nice. A rusty old bicycle. In the middle of an island. I don't think it would take me very far. There's nothing but water around this house. Are hey, you? Yes? Who's speaking? Me. I've been told. I have to tell you something. Yes? What is it? We're in great danger. Don't trust those girls. And why do you say that? Look, girl. I'm a toad. And I know I can swim away from this place. But they won't let me. And every time I try to get out of here. Magically turn. This house is like a magnet. Old and cat magnet. They love us. But not to give us love. To use us. Don't trust them. That's terrible. That's why my kitty's here then. They gave you a recipe with some kind of magic, right? Or give the toad the toad voice from Mario. Oh gosh. How did you know that? Did you see the dead girl in one of our rooms? <laughs> Tried to do it. <laughs> I can't 
to a toad voice. I can't. <laughs> she tried, but she did it wrong. But what should I do then? Oh, God. I'm not a clever toad. But if I were you, I'd be more creative. Creative. Well, I'll try my best. Girl, please save us all. I really want to get out of here. <laughs> I hate you. I hate you all. A big rock. I'll leave it there. And a wooden plank. Okay. Okay, cool. So at least we can go and walk into the thing in the well now. Did you find a solution? I'm meant to be stuck. Okay. I know you have something that you'll see the others can. And how do you know that? I'm a talking toad. That's normal. I don't think so. But if you talk to me, it makes you special, Mario. <laughs> I can't do Mario. <laughs> Magical. I sound like. See some stuff. Nom. Oh, hello. Doubters need the truth on paper. Hello. Doubters, I guess some people believe you when it's written down. But what does it mean? You wrote this. I have papers, yes, but what truth? I don't think it would take me very far. No, child. This dude is trying to catch me. But I ran away. Uh, no, you should be able to post clips. I think everyone can. Mm -hmm. I'm scared. Could you help me? I have a monster inside my head. Um... I can exercise you with the salt. Give you some black candles. <laughs> oh, gee whiz, thanks. Of course you clipped that. Why wouldn't you? Oh, don't make me cut the head off the baby. Good. Like, I still tried it regardless. I didn't want to, but I still did. <laughs> okay, now we can use this at least. She says. You won't try that. Here you go. Mothonomicon. And the toad reading. Oh my goodness. <laughs> Ooh. Can't lift it. It's too heavy. Well, then use this. Donk. 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 Wee. Now what have we got? <gasps> Don't eat that! Oh, never mind. Okay then. Eek! <sighs> Why that burnt? Why? Come on, come on, Lottie. You coming in? What are you doing? Oh, what are you doing, Lottie Dog? What are you doing? I've got the Lottie Dog. You gonna say hello to everyone? You gonna sniff the mic? You going to do the sniffles? Sniff, 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 sniff. Ah, sniff, 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 sniff. Did you chase a seagull? 
did you chase a seagull and a magpie? Did you? Oh, don't eat me. Don't eat me. You've got stinky breath. You've got stinky breath. And you chased a small girl on a bicycle. Oh my goodness. Well, that's a bit scary. Go on the nutty. Uh, soggy paws. If you don't cuddle your pets and smother them with loves, then there's something wrong. Exactly so. Precisely. Damn bloody right. Right, let's save quickly, actually, as well. <laughs> right, frog. Um, well, can I just get rid of the ashes? I don't want the ashes. Just get rid of them. Can you use the tweezers? Oh, I did. Nice. Yes, my mum's here. She, she's in the background. Sarah says hello. Hello, Sarah. How is she? She's literally put, hello, mummy Moffy. Dash. Slutty one. Hello, she's you. Slutty. No, she's not slutty. She's just ambiguous. She's not slutty, she's just ambiguous. She's now laughing, very proud of herself. Oh, see, this is not the first time you've heard my mum, surely. Hang on, hang on. No, no, I don't. No, 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 you're not, I'm just saying. I'm sure, Frosty, you've heard my mum before. You know, Frosty. I've heard. Someone clipped oh, that seven. Is, is he the one with the deep accent? What in the accent? What do you want about? Who with the accent? Oh, that's Raven. Oh. Frosty is the one who I um they do like the little mini games and stuff. Hey. America. America. He's the one that I thought was Canadian, but it's actually American. Hmm. Well, funny you should say that. Apparently, America is quite a big country. Yeah, funny enough. Of... Yeah, I know. Lots of, lots of states. More. more than 50, I think. Isn't there like. Hey, it's other. 52? I don't bloody know. I ain't counting those stars. <laughs> I'm British, mate. Southeast, west. Never eat shredded wheat. Oh great, I've broken now. Oh great, now I'm broken. It is your fault. You've come in here and you've broken everything. You like people from America because they're interesting. Why won't my eyes open? We broke them off. Now we've got to order a new one. Thanks, guys. Thanks. Why am I an eyes not open? Open says me. Oh, thanks, Mum. This is all your fault. I've broken. Try to someone off. Again. Well, what do you think I'm going to do? Please really close my existence and not th chatter like bloody dogs. I don't know where you've gone if you disappear from screen. The second I disappear to them, boosh, that's it. I'm gone forever. I can't believe Mothu does Shut up, Ahmed. No bullying me, Chad. No bully. No bully allowed. There we go. Why is it doing this? Why am I so big? What is this? There we go. Okay. I'm still not... Okay, what has happened? But I'm trying to get on with it, but I'm broken. I'm going, then it'll probably work. Hopefully. Maybe it's tracking you instead. <clears throat> Piss off. Bitch. 
I guess it's from you, mother. I bloody do. There we go. <laughs> I fixed it. <laughs> I fixed it. Yes, who's back? Back again. Morbid's back. Tell a friend. Oh, me, me and mom. Yeah, we are best friends above everything else. I didn't start the chaos or anything. Oh, what have you done, Frosty? 30 seconds, I leave you unattended. 30 seconds. Right, let's go back to the game. Right, there we go. Pretend nothing happened. We're back to the game. Look at this. Quick, hide the lamps. Don't hide them from me. I need them. Uh, the frog died. That's not good to eat bottles. Okay. What does this say? Ooh, we're gonna do our own recipe. Revealing the true soul. The world hides the truth from you. Work your soul through life, and you will understand the purpose of this act. If you try and corrupt this essence, your soul will be hidden, and you'll never see the face of truth. To destroy an impure soul or give freedom to those who are trapped, you will need blood from the executor of the ritual, five black candles, god, ashes to form a pentagram, god, a blue bloomed moonlit rose, salt and pepper, god, and hair for the person you want to bewitch. Draw a pentagram with the ashes inside the black and white square. Put a lighted black candle on every point of the pentagram. Fill a cauldron of water and put the other elements in it. Oil. Pour over the person you want to bewitch and repeat these words while you walk around the pentagram. Bontet ir echren orir bergmak. Oi brr, nami brr, igr bontet in echren orin big bachma. Hond fer mondem gofima, ibr eg utos, in der barmeg bo, ibr misne. Oh. <laughs> okay. Breakfast time, I'm gonna look and I'll message you. Of course, Frosty, thank you for the look. I should play Dark Souls. Oh, shut up. <laughs> the whole game is about finding the light. I can't believe you, Sarah. I can't believe you. Um. Okay. Now what? Now what? Huh? Well, how exactly? What are you and me both? So... Can I look out that window? Hmm. Wait, what do I need again? Big dum dum here. Blue, blue, and midlight rose. Hair from the person you want to be rich, and blood from the executioner. Is there not a hairbrush here I can use? That's a red rose. Can I turn it blue? Can I pick. Use the green crayon? <laughs> so how would I turn that blue? Oh, there's a blue rose up there. But I can't get it. There's the woman here. She's in the water and there's a moon. Can I stab it? To do, what to do, what to do. Can I go and... I know they said I couldn't speak to my cat, but what if I try and speak to my cat? Because there's definitely nothing here, is there? No. Hmm. We still got to do Elden Ring. Yeah, well, I still need to bloody finish it, let alone play it, so absolutely. Classic Mothy, first choice, stab it. I mean, 
not wrong. They locked the attic. But how? I guess I can't talk to Mr. Midnight until they come back. Let's go something in here. Keyhole. <sighs> let me think, let me think, let me think. Would Mr. Frog have anything else for us, you reckon? What a favourite animal besides moths. Uh, don't laugh. Although I'm sure you won't laugh, but it's, it's a giraffe. Giraffe and cats, for sure. No, he just says the same thing. Then you have the thing about the paper. Okay, what, what do you want? Moonlight on the water. You're so beautiful and calm. I always feel like the moon's following me. I wonder if the moonlight does the same job as sunlight. Well, what was the pic There's a picture on the wall. We need a giraffe plushie for moth. Don't. I bloody love giraffes. Don't. I, <laughs> I used to collect a giraffe from every place I went to if they sold any. So, you know, the little plushies. And I ended up with a massive collection. And when I moved, I'm really sad. I had to get rid of a lot of them. Very sad. It's not foxes, I'm afraid, Sarah. But, but foxes are good. I like all animals, to be fair. Right. What is this? Never saw a rose in the ocean. The moon gave her the rose. Uh, I don't know. What have we got? What is this again? Oh my god, it literally says it's a moonlight seed. I'm so stupid. Oh, for goodness sake. Really? I need to stop looking at my items properly. Okay, blue rose, gosh. Blood and hair. Blood and hair. Exposure therapy. be in this room. There's got to be something we missed here. There's the bug again. No. I mean, what does it need? What does it need? Blood from the execution. Okay, well, we could do that. That We could do that now. We could just cut ourselves. That's fine. Oh, I'm sorry, Fran. You didn't need that much blood. You could have just done like a pinprick. I never understand, right, in movies, when they do this, they're like, we need blood for the ritual, and they just slice open their hand. Like, why not just slice open, like, a little bit of your arm? Or even just do a pinprick? Why not just a pinprick? You know what I mean? If you need blood, just do, like, a little pinprick. Or bite your lip. You get me? There's so much, I, I don't understand the logic. Blood for the blood, got skulls for the skull throw. Blood for the blood, got skulls for the skull throw. Blood for the blood, got my sweet red blood. Ew, okay. Um, okay, well, we got that. Hair from the person you want to bewitch. I really should do this instead. But how can I get the hair from the girls? I have to trick them, but how? That's what I'm thinking. So, what does this one say? Examine. I refuse to do this. It can't be a good thing. There must be something else I can do. Mm, 
the owl? Where would we get the hair? Do I take, like, the picture? Devil May Cry 3 did that with a needed blood for a ritual, and the character took a tiny katana to his hand. It's just not necessary. It's really not. Would you would you guys be offended if I looked this one up? Because I have no clue. Moth doubters believe what's written. What's written? I wouldn't be offended. Baby do pull hair? Can't sadly. What's written that it's for the person? Okay, I'm going to, I'm going to, I am going to Google this one because I have no clue. Bear with me. I, d I really hate doing this for games, but I also don't want to be here forever wandering around back and forth. Let me just quickly check this painting first. Okay. Right. Okay. We need a Mother Nomicon vote. So what you're supposed to do apparently is use this on the typewriter. And then she replaces it with number six, hair from your head. There was no indication for that. I know there was like a couple of like, oh, as you said, like written and it's like, oh, I could write on the typewriter. I would not have figured that out. Yeah, I, I, I'll be honest with you, a bit sucky that one. I would not have figured that one out. Okay, let me close the, close the wall. Close. But now we need to find the twins. So, I imagine we just wander around. That seems to work for us. Ooh, look, look at that, lo and behold. Fran, here are the materials you'll need. Have you studied the ritual? Yes, but I need more time. I can't remember all the words. Well, learn them fast and let us know when you're ready. I think you need help getting rid of the bag. I can do it for you. But I may need it. No, you don't. Trust me. If you want to get out of here, the bag must disappear. And I'll take it. You didn't see me. Bye. Wink. So what was in that bag? Heart, head of a young virgin. Ah! Wait, did he run off with the head of a young virgin? Okay, you know what? I'm not gonna ask. Wotty wotty stucky wucky. Instructors and clear need help you help you. I mean, you're not wrong, but... Okay, so I imagine we now say, Oi, I need your hair. Look, ladies, there's something missing. I couldn't find your hair in the bag. The hair, you say? No hair is needed, we know that. But look for yourself. It's written down there in the recipe. <gasps> That's true. How could we miss that? All right. There. Now get prepared. I'll let you know when I'm ready. Okay. So where do we do this? black and white square black and white square black and ah um why is this part painted black and white oh look at us we're in a roll now oh have another stretch close the, is the window closed there you go Mr. Ranch Plug, I am indeed. Mothy, I'm getting an ice cream because I'm sick. Do I get Neapolitan or mango? Hmm. I would say Neapolitan. 
Although Mango is nice, they are both equally as nice, to be fair. But I would say Neapolitan. Guess everyone has different styles and tastes. Okay, so. Yes, you do. Look, it says, draw the pentagram. Oh, ashes. Okay, my bad. Gotta draw them with the ashes. Yeah. Very nicely done, Frat. And then black candles. Noise. Uh, put lit. Okay, we need to light them. Fantastic. Oh, there we go. Pretty fire. Candles lit. Uh, fill a cauldron with water. I can see a cauldron there, so we'll grab that. Noise, noise. Oh, I'll keep this to cook a lovely dinner for my kitty. No, you won't. You're going to fill it with water. Sorry, girl. Okay, we'll do the water first then. Good lord. Fussy, fussy. Water, water in the pot, ready to cook. Okay. Now we do that. Wait, what? Put a cauldron of water and put the oven... Oh, okay. So now we combine and then boil. Okay. Where's the oven? There's the oven. Okay. I forgot to turn on the fire. What turn it on then? Okay. There's a gas stove. Gotcha. Okay. And now we add everything else. Hair. Salt and pepper. Blued. There goes my blood. I hope it tastes good. Oh. And then the blue rose. Goodbye, blue rose. Into the pot now. Perfect. And then... Okay, she said go and show them. Let's go! I think it's though, I, I grew up with a gas oven in, in my old house. And I would just be terrified that we just left the gas on all the time. my nose I hate having the flu oh stormy well I hope you get real soon we're waiting for you Fran oh I've done it look look woo everything's ready let's go to the kitchen good let's go <laughs> well there she is Please sit down and close your eyes, ladies. Close them. Now murder them! Step, 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 step. Sploosh. And now I'll say the words. Bondit il ikran ori bigorma. Oi bre, nami bre. Ik bonde il ikran. Bigorma horn. Mondim gorfma. Ibre ik de irus in merbondig. Imbreminse. Wait a second. That isn't the right spell. You tricked us. Uh oh. I don't think you have a choice, ladies. Oh, oh my lord. Ooh. This isn't right. Oh, well, I've got the key. <laughs> I can free my dear kitty. I'm nervous. I never thought that would kill them. I'm sorry, girls. But now I can get my kitty back. Well, technically they got separated, I suppose. What do you have to say about it? Nope, you have literally nothing to say. Okay. I thought you'd be like, oh, well done. Did a thing. Oh, it's nice that they unlocked it before they uh, died, isn't it? Oh. What is it, Fran? Open the cage. I can't. 
The key doesn't fit. Do you see another keyhole? Oh, uh, yes. I'll go see if it fits there. I'll be waiting. Hurry up. I did. It was in the mirror. Up, up, up. The key was for this keyhole. And what's that? A puzzle? Oh, don't make you do another puzzle. What the bloody... This must be part of the machine. I can't move it. Eh. What? Oh, I can move these ones. Okay. I was like, what? Can I move this one? Nice. Um... Oh, slidey puzzles. Ah! Okay. If I get him there, we'll work our way backwards, but I'm not quite sure where he's supposed to go. Is he supposed to go... There or what? Eh? That type of puzzle really grinds my gears. Oh, stop it. Maybe some sort of engine. Uh. Uh. Maybe line them up? How so? You mean just like in a straight line? Like... What are the head pads? What am I supposed to do with this? I'm gonna try putting them here maybe? Okay, that makes more sense now. <laughs> that makes more sense now. Got you. Okay, okay, okay. I didn't know you could move these ones. Got you. I'm with you now. I'm with you now. Okay. those together if I can. He doesn't spin him. So it must be... This big one next. Don't mind me, just having a little think here about life and everything. 
Okay. There we go! Whoa. I have a brain that I sometimes use. Oh dear. Oh, look at them both. Oh, big brain. And I'm just gonna save so I don't have to do it again. <laughs> Mildly proud of that one. That, that, that was quicker than expected. I'll give myself that. What is this? Two skeletons? They look kind of small. Like me. I can imagine who these two were. Then I'm not the killer. And a key. Sisters promise. We, Clara, and Mia Bolhamet, promise to revenge the unfair destiny it would decide for us. With blood and tears, we promise that we will kill him and bring our bodies back. We won't stand this any longer. Even though we are sisters, we hate each other, and we will always hate each other. Nothing will ever change that. But now with our bodies attached to each other, we can't complete our task. The strongest will live forever, and the weakest must die. Mother must die. Oh, they've got the duo teen as well. Oh, two-headed doll. It must be very old. It's also quite dirty. And I guess they played with it a lot. My toes are also a bit dirty. I miss playing with my dollhouse. The pink rosette. A pretty hair decoration. And that's the blue rosette. I like it very much. The shiny stuff. It looks like a necklace. So I'm guessing there was some kind of science experiment? Possibly? Yeah. Oh. The sisters have a huge scar in the middle. That's scary. Maybe they were two different people after all. Hmm. The bed and floor look familiar. Mother must die. You. My mummy was very good. She hugged me many times. Maybe that mummy wasn't a good mummy at all. Oh dear. This must be the key to the cage, finally! Duotine. My pills are called Duotine too. Hmm, but they've got the yellow ones. I wonder what the difference is. Ooh, we're getting some lore. Okay. Oh no, we need to be upstairs. Get the cat. Mmm. Oop it. Hello, pretty cat. I think this is the key. It, it worked, my dear kitty. It worked. Come out. Let me hug you. Go and hug. Yay! Oh, that's adorable. Oh! Oh, this is adorable. Oh, this will give my heart. I can't. Please tell me nothing bad happens to the cat. Because there's one thing in games I cannot handle, and that has anything happening to cats. That is the one thing in video games and film I cannot handle. Oh. Oh, this feels so good. I'm Free Fan, my good friend. Free, my dear. Now it's time to go home. Yes, let's go. What about the babies? Are they still there? <gasps> oh. Just a doll now. Oh. Sleepy doll. Would you mind singing to me? Ah, you don't want to, huh? Well, that's okay. I can sing for myself. need to get home, Kitty. I hope the way back home isn't far. I hope so too, Fran. We can do this together. I can help you. Okay. So how do we leave? Through the window, or...? I mean, would you like to eat first? You've not eaten. It said you were hungry. 
Look at the ashes. <laughs> Mr. Frog, do you know how to get out here? Here you go. I did it, Sir Toad. The girls are gone. That's perfect. Now I can leave this place and return to my family. I want to do that too, sir. I finally found my kitty. I just want to go home now and be with Aunt Grace. How will you get out of here? It's no boat. Well, I thought you could help us get out of here. I'd love to help you, but I'm too tiny. Even though my body is quite malleable, it would be impossible to carry you both to the other side. Hmm. Let me think about it. Don't leave yet, please. Baking soda! Take this toad. <laughs> I'm not a bakery man. But you're all slimy and soft like dough. Right. May work. Here it goes. I don't know why that worked, but sure. <laughs> I was like, that's the only thing I've got in my inventory. I'm falling asleep. I'm going to go and get some rest. Of course. Thank you, sweetheart. You take care. Some wonderful rest. Thank you. I can't believe that works. I'm so big. Die for gorgeous. Great. Let's go. Come, Mr. Midnight. Sure, Fran. Oh, sure, Fran. I only have one complaint. That giant toad is staring at me. What are you talking about? He wants to help us, that's all. All right. But if he tries anything, I'll scratch him. That's okay. But try not to hurt him too much while we're sitting on him. The water is deep, and we don't know what kind of creatures are in there. If we fall in the water, we could die, Kitty. Mm. Oh, I promise I won't scratch Toad. Let's go. I want to. I want to. I want to give. I might. I might give Mr. Midnight a new voice. I don't. I don't like his high-pitched voice. I've changed my mind. We're going to change his voice. I do declare. Before we go. I forgot to give you something. I saw you in this picture, so I thought it was yours. Oh, it is mine. Thank you, Mr. Frog. Oh, Mr. Toad. This book was with it, too. Ooh. Oh, the book is. Oh, Toad. You found my family photo. I thank you very much. I thought I'd lost it forever, but the book isn't mine. Oh, well. Take the book as a gift. It's healthy to read. It does many pictures. Wow. Thank you. I like pictures. Well, let's go now. Yes, here we go. Hold on tight. <laughs> oh, I love it. Oh, no. Don't make me play Frogger. It's just like claymation. What is this? Oh, this is cool. Wow! Oh, I love this. Oh, don't make me play Frogger. I can't play Frogger. Looking awful at it. Well, I need to lock here first. Come on. There we go. Okay, this is our chance. No! <laughs> okay. Oh, just about. This Okay. Oh, come on. I was totally on that. Okay, at least it doesn't completely restart. Um, bum, bum, bum. Um, bum, bum. This is so cute. Look at this animation. I love this. Oh, no. I'm... Oh, no. I'm good. Oh, that was a panic. Okay. Okay. What have we got? What have we got? Uh oh. Oh, okay. Oh, I was enjoying that. That was good. <gasps> that was fantastic. Here we are. Jump off now. Let's go, Kitty. Think. Well, now. 
time to go home. I hope you find your family soon, Sir Toad. Oh, thank you. You too. Farewell. Goodbye, sir. And thank you for the ride. Bye. Gran, what should we do now? There you go. That's his voice. Find the way back home, Kitty. Do you see the sky? It's dawn, and really soon all of the scary things will disappear. <sighs> I'm so hungry and sleepy. I want to go home now. <laughs> Rude. Me too, Kitty. We'll find the way. I'll do my best to help you, my dear. Let's go. Oh, Kitty, what's the first thing you'll do when we get home? Eat, of course. Eat until I fall asleep. And you? <laughs> I think I would like the same. Are you a stone? It'd be grand to see a troll. Beautiful flowers. He's just licking his bum. <laughs> okay, let's save quickly. Oh dear. This bridge looks pretty scary. Fran, come on. We have to go home. There's no time to be afraid now. Yes, but I'm a bit afraid of heights. Um, I can go first, all right. Then you follow me. Right, Kitty. You're so sweet. I'll be right behind you. <laughs> oh, this is precious. This is so precious! Fran, wait. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Oh no! Oh no! You bastard! No! Oh, her eyes! Dear. I'm not holding anymore. I don't want to die. You won't die, my friend. Come on, you can do it. Jump! All right, here I go. I got you. Oh, the little ball! The little ball! Don't be afraid, Fran. We always fall. And after the pain, we always rise. Oh, the was, was very good. Very good. Aww. Aww. Yeah, Aunt Grace is definitely the killer. Aunt Grace, please don't leave me. Don't cry, my little girl. Your heart is pure, but your mind is tormented. You have to stay and walk your own path. Please, Aunt Grace. Won't just take me out of here, please. You're going to leave me all alone, like my mother and father did. I'm sorry, my dear Fran. You will understand soon. Oh, poor Fran. Oh, Chris, don't go, please. Please. <laughs> Fran, it's time for your new medicine. No. Oh no! Ooh? Ooh! Huh? What happened? Where am I? Fran, where are you? Okay. Oh, I was gonna stop it there, but it won't let me save. Fran Chu. These are Fran's stockings. Ugh, what an ugly.
ugly tree. I'll scratch you, you evil thing. Kitty, Kitty, stop it. What are you talking about? Friend, my darling, is that you? It can't be. What is it, my dear? Of course it's me. Who else would I be? Fran, you're a tree! <laughs> Don't be silly. Help me get up. Wait a second. Where are my hands? And why can't I move? I'm telling you, my dear, you've turned into a tree. But, but how? My dear, this, this is the end of the line. The big monster I did this. I know, Kitty, he won't let us go home. I hope he doesn't come back. That's very scary. He always comes back. If I remembered from that night, the night Mom and Dad died, Kitty, I don't want to talk about it. I just want to go home. But you're a tree, my friend. A tree! <laughs> Can't carry you all the way back home. Besides, I'm not sure where we are either. Am I going to die, Kitty? Tell me. Please don't say that, Fran. Don't leave me. That's... I feel so weak. What the... What? What is going on? spoken to you by a bloody carrot now sure i'm not even gonna try and wait don't poke me <laughs> Just be careful sir why are you attacking me Can you please tell me where i am sir what They saying, oh, my kitty, why is this happening to us? Stop attacking me, please. I mean no harm. Just <laughs> kitty, find my purse, please. Maybe I could do something about this. I'll see what I can do, Fran. Okay, now we can save. <laughs> the little poor icons are so cute. Okay, okay. Double check. Yeah. Well, unfortunately, that is where I am going to have to call it for now. We got a good chunk in. I I don't know how many chapters there are, but I feel like we we must be surely like just under halfway, maybe. I feel like it at least. Anyway. chapters are there one two three four five okay so we are but just part three or five okay that's not too bad we made some good progress then that's some good progress that's some good progress and i'm thoroughly enjoying it so it has not felt like it's been five and a half hours at all bloody hell where has that time gone <laughs> where has that time gone oh my word Wow. <sighs> oh, a time does fly when you're having fun. You're quite right there. Thing is, tomorrow, I know I've said I've got a reading stream tomorrow, but I'm kind of tempted just to continue Fran. Rather than wait till like Tuesday. I don't want to wait till Tuesday. I, w I want to play it immediately. <laughs> Would people be offended if I postponed the reading stream tomorrow? Ooh, I don't know what happened there. That was scary. And we'll have the reading stream like Tuesday instead. Tuesday or Wednesday. No, I can't do it Tuesday. Oh, phonics. Wednesday. We could do it Wednesday, maybe. Um, well, unfortunately, I'm quite limited in what we can read. But I was thinking about finally doing Call of Cthulhu. Because believe it or not, I, I have the web a website I use, which is the Lovecraft list. It essentially has all of them. 
all of the works um, from A to Z, and we're working our way through them. And the next one on the list is Call of Cthulhu, which I know everyone's been highly excited for. Mm -hmm. it's, it was either between that or maybe doing something completely different to doing something like Sleepy Hollow. But I'm not sure. The thing is that I, we can only stick to books that are either written permission for to be read aloud or are free public domain. Which is fine by me. Right. Let's see who we can go and irritate. Who do you reckon we can go and irritate? Hmm. What? Oh, it's Paul live. Come on. Yeah. Okay. Paul Kawaii is live. We're going. We're going to raid Paul. I love Paul. Hmm. 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 So for those who don't know, Paul Kawaii is absolutely f***ing adorable. I love them so much. They're a small little bane. <laughs> and she's playing some Elder Scrolls Skyrim because she's actually good at games, unlike me. So, you know. Time flies, so you have wings. I know, it goes so fast. And it's not fair. I look forward to stream and then it happens and then it's over. And it's like, ah! It's like, where does the time go? Not fair at all. <laughs> oh dear. But yes, it is now currently uh, half past one in the afternoon for me, so I have to go and do things. I know. Ugh. Ugh. Even I have to do my own uh, house chores and things like that. I've got a lot of tidying to do. And I'm going to have a bath as well tonight, so that'll be nice. <laughs> but I hope you all look after yourselves. Thank you so much for joining me. I hope you had fun. I hope you're enjoying the game, because I know I certainly am. You don't even need to ask me if I'm enjoying the game, because you bet your bottom I am. You guys are quite right. I should trust you more, chat, honestly. Maybe a little terrorist, but you do quite know what I like, don't you? Hmm. Yes. <laughs> but thank you so much for being here, whether you're new, whether you're old. It doesn't matter. Whether you've been chatting, whether you've been lurking. Whatever you've been doing, thank you so much for being here. I appreciate you, and you should appreciate yourself. We are going to go and raid Paul Kawaii, who is playing Elden Ring. I don't know what- what's the raid message going to be? What are we going to have? The art is fantastic. I, lo I love all of it so far, it's really well paced. The only thing I'm not too keen on is definitely the puzzles. They, they're a bit... Eh. Eh. We were a tree? Wait, that could be the message. Moth trees unite? I don't know. Moth become tree? Tree become moth? I'm sure you guys can figure something out. Come on. You can do a raid message, I believe. Sticks and stones may break my bones, but moths will never hurt me. <laughs> We were a tree. That'll do. That'll do. We were a tree. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Tree raid. <laughs> but yes, thank you so much for being here. I hope you have an absolutely fantastic... Read the Mothronomicon. Ooh, that's also a good one. But the Mothronomicon, it's mine and mine alone. <laughs> anyway, thank you so much. Have a wonderful day, night, morning, evening, whatever it is for you. I hope you have an absolutely delightful one. Thank you so much. Take care of yourselves. Doodle Pip, Cheerio, and all of that jazz. I'll see you all very soon. Remember, we were a tree. <laughs> Goodbye! <laughs> Who's gonna die? What do you think, Jack?